Across the UK, online and on DAB. Take a far out trip into the twilight zone of late night radio with Ian Unmissable late night radio with the original king of unconventional conversation. Make contact with Ian Lee. Late night Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. It's an honour. It's a thrill. Uh, Angelos Epithemeo, have I got the last name right, uh, Angelos? No, not even nowhere near, mate. Not even, not even the right ballpark. Epith- Epithemeo. 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 No, I don't think you. I don't think you. Um, you say it like what? that. What well, my name? I don't say my name like like I say it. How do you spell it? E p i t h e m i. And then it goes all a bit, you know, fuzzy at the end there. Uh, Kali Nikta? Where is your face, sir? Kala? I chance, la la la. Um chaka. Now, Angelos. <laughs> if it. Are you okay? Yeah. What are you yeah, doing? Yeah, yeah. Oh, on up. Just up there. Up where? Yeah, up there. Okay, down now. Angel, really? yes, I'm ready. We're, we're doing it. We're in. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's give it both barrels. I tell you what, we're gonna do. For, the, oh. for no, for those, for those who don't know your work, I'm gonna set the agenda. Oh, go on then. Well, obviously, I've come on to uh, plug my show. I know, but before we do that, we'll do that. And uh, my book. Uh, did, uh, you didn't mention the book. Hey. You you didn't mention you had a book to plug. Well, I haven't written it yet, that's why. But I will write one, so I want to plug that as well. Where will people know you from? Oh, they'll probably know me from off the telly. Um, I've worked extensively with the shooting stars people, um, and I've worked on uh, all sorts of things as well. Um, like, like, for example... Um, what do you mean? For example. Yeah, I work with him. That's shit. No, for for example, I mean, yes. uh, and I'm going to give you an example of an example. Um, oh, right, just do that. Shooting yeah, stars. Guys. Shooting yeah, stars. Shooting stars. Yeah, I was on shooting stars. I said that. I worked extensively with them. Yeah. I was on that show. I'd done the scores on it. And I was on the panel with it, and I had my own show actually on but Channel Four, which I'd forgotten about. You weren't you weren't the baby man, were you? No, I'll come after him. Yeah, I'll come after him. Okay, we've got um, a caller on the line. Would you mind talking to a caller, Angelos? Across the UK, online and on DAB. Take a far out trip into the twilight zone of late night radio with Ian. Unmissable late night radio with the original king of unconventional conversation. Make contact with Ian Lee. Late night Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. Hello, dear listener. Ian Lee. Talk Radio. That's us. Um, uh, yes, 0844. 499-1000 is the tele... Is that, is that our guest on that line there? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, the way the show works, I sit here, I talk about stuff, you can call in about it. So I'm prepared for the show. I needed to get some... Um, oh, go away, computer. I need to find out some information about our next guest. Maybe he can tell us himself. And you know what? I don't always do this, because I know that some of you can be a cruel lot. So when we have a guest on, I don't always um, invite you on... To, to phone in and um, um, uh, comment with the guest. Sorry, the reason I'm sounding like I can't speak English is primarily because I can't. But I reckon this guest can probably take it. I, I've heard he's got big balls, big gojones, and I've, I've, seen him, um, I've, I've seen him perform. So I suspect if you phone up and you want to, you know, ask him a question or give him some, I bet he could probably take it. Uh, 0844 499 1000. It's, it's, um, it's an honour. It's a thrill. Uh, Angelos Epithemeo, have I got the last name right, uh, Angelos? No, not even, nowhere near, mate. Not even, not even the right ballpark. Epith- Epithemeo. 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 No, I don't think you, I don't think you, um, you say it like what? that. 
Well, my name. I don't say my name like like I say it. How do you spell it? E p i t h e m i. Then it goes all a bit, you know, fuzzy at the end there. Uh, Kali Nikta. Where is your face, sir? Kala. I can't say that. Um Chaka. Now, Angelos. If it, are you okay? Yeah. What are you yeah, doing? Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's just on up. Just up there. Up where? Yeah, up there. Okay, down now. Angel, really? yes, I'm ready. We're, we're doing it. We're in. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's give it both barrels. I tell you what let's we're gonna go. do. For, the, oh. for no, for those for those who don't know your work. I'm just gonna set the agenda. Oh, go on then. Well, obviously I've come on to uh, plug my show. I know, but before we do that, we'll do that. And uh, my book. Uh, did, uh, you didn't mention the book. Hey? You you didn't mention you had a book to plug. Well, I haven't written it yet, that's why. But I will write one, so I want to plug that as well. Where will people know you from? Oh, they'll probably know me from off the telly. Um, I've worked extensively with the shooting stars people. Um, and I've worked on, uh, all sorts of things as well. Um, like... Like, for example? Uh, what do you mean? For example? Yeah, I've worked with him. That's shit. No, for, for example, I mean... Yes. Uh, and I'm going to give you an example of an example. Um, oh, right, let's do that. Shooting yeah, stars. Guys. Shooting yeah, stars. Shooting stars, yeah, I was on shooting stars, I said that. I worked extensively with them. Yeah. I was on that show, I'd done the scores on it, yeah. and I was on the panel with it, and I had my own show, actually, on but Channel 4, which I'd forgotten about. You weren't, you weren't the baby man, were you? No, I'll come after him. Yeah. I'll come after him. Okay. We've got, um, a caller on the line. Would you mind talking to a caller, Angelos? What do they want? Um, well, uh, uh, Alan, you're through to Angelos. Evening, evening, Angelos. Hello, Alan. How are you, sir? All right, where are you calling from? I'm calling from Birmingham in the West Midlands. Oh, yeah, I know that place. I've been there. Whereabouts in Birmingham have you been to? I've been to the West Midlands. Yeah, which part? I went to, um, Didcot. Is that near Coventry? I don't know. I think that might be near Coventry. You, you, you come from there, so I'll you will know better than I do. Who? I come from Birmingham. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, mate. Yeah, but I thought it was near Coventry. Right. Yeah, I know. Uh, don't, okay, this is getting off to a really uncomfortable start. Alan, uh, Alan by the way, Angelos, uh, uh, Alan is real. Alan, have you got a question for Angelos? Yeah, yeah I was going to say, what was the... What would you like working with Davina McCall on Big Brother's Big Mouth? What would you like working with her? Yeah. He's really good. Because she is an idol of mine. All oh, right, okay. What What do you like about her? No, she's, she's very fun to be with. She's good natured and she puts you at ease. Have you been with her, Alan? And did she put you at ease when you were with her? I've actually met her once. Yeah. When she was doing one of our episodes called Love on a Saturday Night. Oh, right, yeah. You was on that, was you, Alan? No, my shoes was. Huh? Your what was? My shoes. Your shoes were? Yeah. Your shoes were on Love on a Saturday Night? Yeah, for their Meet Me on a Sunday feature. Literally no okay. idea what you're talking about. It, 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 was, it, was, it was one of the worst shows that I to be ever did. Okay. Alan, it, have you finished your, your questions for Angelos? Yes, thank you. OK, mate. Yeah, ta -ra. Nice. Nice guy. Nice guy. Any called... more? No, not at the moment. The phones have not exactly lit up. Oh, well, well give, give it a matter of time. I, I will, um, I'll just sort of plug some stuff. Well, well, plug, can you plug stuff, and I don't want to get, you know, can you plug stuff that you've done or, or, or that you're going to be doing, but not stuff that is just like a, a thought you've had? Yeah, I can... Yeah, OK. What, now? Well, yeah. You've done this before. Okay. You've had your own TV show and stuff, and I've seen you do, do um, um, stand-up, and you're very, very funny. 
Yeah. So you know how this works? Oh, okay, okay, I'll, I'll plug it. I'll plug it now. Here we go, ready? Ready? I tried to plug it earlier and you told me not to plug you it. You tried to plug a book that you just thought you just thought you were going to write a book one day. Yeah, that's all right. And I'll need to get it out there so <laughs> people are prepared. That's not how it works. For the idea, you you're, know? So you're... Let, all, let that sink in. Let it shape into the zeitgeist. Right. Okay, so people want the book. People will, will want the book. Oh, you Angelos is writing a book. Whoa, brilliant. Yeah, exactly. And then they'll start saying what it's about on twi- Twitters. Yeah. And then I'll have a look at that. I'll go right. That's what they want. And I'll write. I'll write what it is what they've been asking for on Twitter. And How? then I'll have beaten beaten the system. How do you get on with Twitter? Because I'm I've unfollowed everyone on Twitter at the moment because I'm I'm annoyed with it. How are you getting on with Twitter? Oh, I love Twitters. I love Twitters, you know. I can watch all the programs and just sit there and make um, really funny um, comments about it, you know, and people uh, like what I say and they like what I do. Give us an what example. Trying... Give us an example. So imagine you're watching Casualty. What, what would Give us some of the tweets that you'd send about Casualty. All right, I'll, I'll have a look at... Um, I'd have a look at what they was doing first within context of the show, and I'd say, oh, look, his hands are shaking when he's doing that um, when he's doing that operation there on that broke heart. I reckon he's probably got, you know, drunk. And then people will, you know, laugh at that and they'll blow they'll like it and they'll retweet it. We've got a caller we've got Barry from Watford. Barry, good evening. Hello, Hello. everyone. Hello, Barry. You all right, mate? All right, mate, how's it going? All right. Yeah, mate, yeah, absolutely. Chip chop. He knows what he's doing this year, isn't he? And he's ever stood, isn't he? I yeah, mean, for someone actually. who's been kicked out of so many stations, he, he oh, can no, still do say. it. Yeah, he, he still can... knows how to press them buttons, doesn't he? Have... I'll, say, I'll say. Yeah, have you got a question, Barry, for yes. Angelos? Hello, Angelos. I have... You've done I've that bit. Question. We've done the okay. hellos. Okay. I'm just trying to drive this on a little bit. Uh, yeah. Because we don't normally have a guest at the start of the show, and I okay. remember why. Here we go. Okay. Uh, Ready? Yes. Hello? Here we go. Hello. Go. Go. Hello. 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 Speaking. Hello. Hello. We're all speaking now. Stop. Uh, go. Hello, Andrews. Here's my question uh, for you. Have uh, you plugged our show yet, or...? <laughs> I'm just going to plug it now, Barry, but he keeps stopping me from oh, plugging it. I don't then. stop... I don't... Other people getting other people on the phone. Speak to it. Tell him what it's all about. Right, I, I t- I'm, gonna, I'm trying to tell him, Barry. I'm okay. trying to tell him, but he's he's trying to hamstring me. Yes, he is. He's is. Not, I'm not doing I'm not doing a Paxman on you or anything. I, I've got you on, so we'll have a little chat. We'll find out a little bit about you. So you can't just come on and go. I've got a podcast and I'm doing a live live tour and stuff because people won't, might not know who you are. Yeah, Speak well, I'm to... trying to tell them who I am. Well, yeah. <laughs> But I'm trying to help you tell them who you are, because if anything, Angelos, and I, I, I say this with love, you're muddying yeah. the waters ever so slightly. All right, mate. Well, look, all they've got to do is just go <laughs> online. Yes. <laughs> right? Yes. All yeah. they've got to do is go online and type in, all right, Angelos said, thing you, and then, I'll, then they'll see who I am. And I'm sure you can't I'm... expect people to go on Wikipedia, my guests. It's a... The other belly on the 13th yeah, of May. Yeah, Thank you, Barry. On right. the 13th of May, and we're doing a show, me and Angelos. Right, and yeah, what... We're doing a show. Oh, yeah. uh, and what is, what is the show? Go on, you oh, see. Yeah. Well, what we're doing really is we're trying to tap into the zeitgeist. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Do you know what the zeitgeist the... means, Angelos? Yeah, we're tapping yeah. into it. What is, what you, in... What's the zeitgeist, Angelos? What does that mean? It's like German, it's German, it's German yeah. stuff. So you talk about German stuff? Well, no, oh, actually, nice. we talk about Chinese, yeah. actually. we got a spectacular Chinese opening, haven't we, Barry? Yeah, it's ever so spectacular. It's all Chinese when we start. All Chinese. So it's, ra- it's, it's a racist Chinese. show? No, no, racist. We, no we, we love the Chinese. We're banging yeah. them. We're banging celebrating the, the culture. Chinese. I tell you what I'm gonna do, right? The word, the R word, has been bandied around a bit. Can I just take a quick break, right? And when we come back, George, we what got... are you gonna do? Sorry, 
What are you going to do in the break? Well, we're going to play some adverts, and then when we come back, we'll plug the yeah. show again on um, May the 13th. Yeah. Okay. We'll plug the podcast. Yeah. Oh, good. And Barry, are you going to be sticking around? Yes, please. I want to read out some of my erotic literature. <laughs> All right, I'd stay there. Dan, we've got Dan on the line as well, wants a question. 0844 499 1000. Okay, right, start to the show. We're um, uh, doing things a little bit differently. Uh, we've got a guest, we've got Angelos uh, on the line. Good Hello. 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 Can you hear me, Angelos? Excuse me. Hello. I don't think he can hear me, Kath. Oh, okay. I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can, yeah. Okay, just. Okay, uh, we've got Barry from Watford on the line as well. Hello, I can hear you loud and clear. Okay. And you two do a podcast together. Yes. yes. I've not listened to it. Oh. Would one of you like to tell me what it's about? Go on. Barry, do you want to do that? No, you do it. Okay, I'll do it. Well, what we're doing with the podcast is we sit down and we talk about stuff for half an hour. Lots of things what have been going on, but mostly we're just trying to tap into the zeitgeist. Again with the zeitgeist. <laughs> what was what the was ch- the Chinese zeitgeist? They're yeah. the worst kind. They're deadly. Those ones. Oh God, man. Uh, okay, and so well, and we, you... we do cover a lot of subjects, so it's quite hard to just fit it all into a nutshell, you know. Yeah. Pick one sub. What was in the what was the last podcast you recorded? Uh, you, you want to know the title of it? No. What was what, what? was the, what was the what were the subjects in the well, last podcast? You, uh, let me finish. What? Let me finish the question. Oh, and I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to the guest. Oh. Angelos. He's he's on his own um, TV show, Barry. Um, <laughs> oh, that's nice, isn't it? Well, it's true. That's charming, isn't it? Yeah, that's charming. charming. It's, well, it's true. He's a celebrity, Barry. You're just some old, you know, <laughs> bloke that calls up calls me up and annoys me. What was in what were in the what was in the last podcast you recorded, Angelos? Well, it was all lots of stuff about um, Hollywood. I'd have thought. And, <laughs> I thought. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and there was there would have been there would have been stuff Shakespeare. There was quite a lot of Shakespeare in it. So so it's a but bit we, yeah. And what else was in it, Barry? Oh, we've done the thing about manners. There was yeah, a, in the Daily Mail. Yeah. There was a, a you know test your etiquette. Oh yeah, right. And we done the, all the, the Beatles, who? all the Lost Beatles song we done. Yeah, we have right. done all the Lost okay. Beatles we, songs. We got, I think we got we got we got plenty there. Oh. You're doing a, a live show. This is in London, is it? Yeah, this Lon- is in London. This is on the South Bank um, of London um, on the on the river. Next to the National Theatre, yep. and all, where all, all the hoity um yeah. there's a big cow that's purple, and they turn it upside down, and they stick people in it for a month. Yeah. If right? you had to go in, if you had to enter an animal, let's start with yeah. you, Barry. If you had to enter an animal, what animal would you enter, Barry? Oh, mate, what are you talking about? Nice oh, oh. What do you mean, enter an animal? Whatever <laughs> <laughs> you to... That was never proven. How dare you? <laughs> it's a charming question, isn't it, that? I don't mind it. It. They, I mean, they I invite mean, you one of these things and then they ask you that. Jesus. <laughs> well, what is it, though? What is, what is the animal? If though? you had to enter an animal, Barry, to save your family, what animal yeah. would you... That's a good question, you know. Oh, that's a very good question. You've got question. to do it, otherwise you're all your family die, including Dave, your son. Oh, well. Well, really old. Is, he, is he gone to the head time, mate? God blimey. Yeah. That's interesting. You must enter man. animal now or we kill family <laughs> of man. Which animal? <laughs> uh, well, Bang! You've just had your son shot. Your son's just oh. been shot. Barracuda, that would give you no bother. Well, they wouldn't be looking at you, would it? I wouldn't like to see its eyes. It'd be up the neck, it's up there. It wouldn't be yeah. looking at you over its shoulder going, what are you doing? You know what I mean? <laughs> Judging you. Judging you with those eyes. Yeah, you don't want that, do you? You want something that can't really turn its head? Y- yes. 
Tommy, yeah. don't you? Yeah. What, would you, them, what, would you enter, gonna, what would you enter? What would you enter, Angel? Obviously, if you had to, to, to protect your family. Our oh, competition. <laughs> I meant an animal. So it was the same question. Uh, I just abbreviated it right. for time. Probably a zebra. Yeah. I mean, they're not, they're not easy to lay your hands on one of them. No, so you'd no. Have to, you, you'd have to go, you'd have to live either near... Oh, hang on a minute. Yeah, oh, hang on, I've lost you, I've lost him. Hang on a second, hang on a second. Yeah, go on. Sorry, we, we lost you, Angelos. Okay, they're not easy to lay your hands on one of them. So you'd have to live yeah. either near a zoo or in a zoo or uh, in Africa. Dan's on the line. Dan, you've got a question. Is, question, is it for Angelos? It's for Angelos, but I suppose also for Barry. Okay, Dan, away oh. you go, mate. Um, well, Barry's quite an old man, so he, he's obviously worldly wise. And Angelos, I believe, has some medical training. Um, yes. Now, now I've had what, what medical tra- What medical training have you got, Angelos? Yeah, never mind. Carry on, Dan. <laughs> Thank you. It, it's horrible, this surgery is interrupting, isn't it? Um, I had a cold, and now I have an ear infection. I'm in incredible pain, Angelos, and I really don't know what to do with myself. All right. Can What's you help me? Or do I have to phone Anna Rayburn? No, it'll be something to do with your bum. I default. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> Stick a pencil out there. Up my bum? Yeah. I, 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 I yeah, that's from just... IBS. Do you oh, think yeah, it's connected? What you, yeah. No, get yourself stood on the toilet bog, on the right. on the on the bowl, of the toilet. Pull your pants down. Right. <laughs> yeah. Turn your bum round. Have a look in the mirror. Right. right. And see if to see if there's any like pink spots on it. Do that now. On my bum. The, the yeah. problem is, I'm, I'm I'm quite a heavy fellow, and I rent a house. I'm not sure my toilet can cope with me standing on it. <coughs> Stick a pencil. Yeah, well, maybe get a. Yeah, stick a pencil up it. Dan, the advice there is um, to stick a pencil up your bum. An HB. Yeah. Well, it should, should really be an HB, yeah. Can we just... You better just give a disclaimer. You know, you are oh, not yeah, you do, you, you do that. I mean, I would just say, of course, this yeah. is pure conjecture. What Angelos yeah, recommends... Yeah, I'm, I'm not, a pencil I'm not doctor. doctor. Yeah. yeah, I'm not really a lot of BM, BM, whatever they are, BMA doctor. I'm no. a witch doctor. No, but, you know, give it a go with a pencil and yeah, try that. Yeah, because yeah, it, it does work, it does work. You'd be yeah. very surprised. Yeah, you yeah. certainly need to take your mind off it. Yeah. Good luck. Very the best of luck. OK, Dan. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Good luck. <sighs> Anyone else there? <laughs> Anyone else got any medical problems? There's nobody else. I didn't know you had medical training. I would have touted it as a medical hour. Very popular. Oh, he has. Yeah, yeah, I've got lots of that. Okay, what's what's in? I've now I've seen you, Angelos, and it's it's very funny. What's in your bag? You carry a bag around with you a lot, don't you? Yeah. What's in the bag? Yeah, I do. Well, I've got my car keys in there. (laughs) Um, I've got my uh, upper keys in there. I've got my stationery, all my stationery goes in there, uh, and my super glue, and uh, I carry some nuts in there as well for, uh, you know, emergencies and stuff. So that's usually what's, what's in there, and then there's all other stuff I nick along the way. And this is all, it's like, it's, it's just a carrier bag, isn't it? Yeah, it's a carrier bag, yeah, it's a carrier bag. There's nothing special about it, but it's cheap, you know? Where did you get your break into show business? Because I'd imagine that yours is not a normal route into performing, no. Angelos. It's not the average route, no. I um, I uh, used to own a burger van. Did you know that? I know what a burger van is, yeah. A van that sells burgers, yeah? Did you know that I had one? No, this is, I, don't, I don't know the story, so I'm asking it. Okay. Well, I had one of them, a uh, burger van. A burger van. Yeah, and it was a award-winning burger van. Oh yeah, and um, what awards did you win? Best uh, clean surfaces, best use of disinfectant, uh, best use of tea urn. So, uh, so for the cleanliness, uh, not for the food. Okay, yeah. Most most level van. I won that one as well. (laughs) 
Anyway, yes. Bob Morton was come and have a burger up there, and he like he he, he got chatting to me, and then he says, "Do you want to come on my show?" And I said, "Okay, I will." Yeah, I'll come on his show, and I went on shooting stars, and then um, and then I and I, then I was on there for ages. Okay. And then I, and then it all just went mental for me. Okay. And Barry, how did you meet Angelos? Well, we we done a show for a, a ra- an internet radio station for a bit. So that's how you met. No, but how, no, but how did you meet him to do the show? Oh, well, I used to do my yeah, in the bog at the Hundred Club in London. I was doing my popular bingo show. Yeah, yeah. And uh, he turned up. He done a bit of a turn. Oh dear. Yeah, and, oh, uh, he had a bit of a turn. Yeah. He had a bit of a turn, and yeah. then uh, we'd done a show and ended up owing us three grand, so <laughs> we started doing our own podcast. Yeah, they did owe three grand, by the way. Yeah. yeah. They did. No. Yep. I don't hey, know why you. they refused to pay us. I thought it was a very why good not? show. You're a very good show. Okay, listen, I think we've got time for one more call. We're going we're gonna to try and... Okay. I, I can see that Russ is... is... Well, what else are you doing? Who? Me? Yeah. What? I'm doing this. Well, what do you mean you think you've got time for one more call? What else would you be doing? I mean, there's well, nothing else to talk about, is there? No. <laughs> We're going to have another call for you, and then I'm going to I'm going to let you go in about three or four minutes. Oh, oh, okay. It's only for the first half hour. Sorry if I didn't make that clear. Okay. You. S- you sound disappointed. No, do you do you like, mate? Do you like? Do you like? Okay. I'm just a puppet. Well, no, don't get don't get a cob on about it. It's you, you, you're yeah, again... whatever. Just put the caller on, will you? We're, we're trying to contact him. His his phone's. Oh, he's gone, is he? Yeah, yeah it looks like it. Probably yeah. probably because there's a bit of an attitude coming from the guest. Yeah. Oh, you really? know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Hang on a minute. Oh. If I press what this, is she, what, how long is the show of yours then? One, it's, it's three hours. Where's the station? It's, it's talk radio. Yeah. It's three hours long. And, Russ, you can say hello to Russ right. now, Angelos. Who's Russ? Hello, Russ. Hey, up, Angelos. How are you, mate? How you doing, man? You're a legend, man. Legend. How are you? Hey, legend, legend. You? Okay, I'm okay, I think, Russ. I'm okay, mate. How are you? Uh, not bad, mate. Not bad. I say it's uh, cracking the. Uh... Cracking interview, I'm enjoying this tonight, you and uh, Ian, and uh, is it Barry? Thank, Thank you. Right. Thank you. Right. Where are you from? I'm from, uh, I'm from uh, Staffordshire, mate, Staffordshire, Litchfield. Oh, yeah, yeah, all that, yeah, yeah, brilliant, brilliant. Have, brilliant, you, been, have you been there, Angelos? Nah. Well, what do you want, just to, what do you want to ask? Uh, well, I was, uh, you see, yeah, I've noticed, um... In the past, uh, Angelos, Angelos is a, a bit of lover of the, the old carrier bag, and um, he's a man mm. after my own heart. You see, I'm, uh, I've got I've got rather a vast collection of carrier bags. Oh, uh, right. I, I wondered if you might be do, interested in in some swaps. Oh, yeah, definitely. What carrier bags have you got then? What what have I've, you got I'll, any specialist stuff? Oh, oh, mate, telling you, I've got I've got I've got your quick save jobs, your um, oh, state right, bags. Yeah. You know, these are all obsolete, okay. mate. So. Um, Budgins? Got any budgins? I'm interested in some budgins. Um, well, some I'm after myself. I've, I've, I've okay. been trying to get a budgins for a while. Uh, Guys, this is this is this is not really going in the direction I wanted it to. So I'm going to say good radio, though. No, it, this is good stuff. It's not. So I'm it's going to. It's not. Russ, thank you. We may speak later on. <laughs> you spo- you're spoiling my oh, No, I'm not spoiling. Yeah, Russ. Give me a call privately, mate. We'll pick yeah. this up another time. No, well, that's d- it, mate. Nice one. Cheers, Angelos. Don't worry about him. Uh, yeah, so, so, so you, Ian. Okay. I'll, I'll think, uh, I think I think Angelos should take over this show. Okay, thanks, Russ. That's yeah, that's mate. Russ gone. That's that's we got rid of Russ. Right. So the the podcast people can get it. Where, where can they get it? On iTunes, I suppose, and Podbean and places yes. like that. Yes, they can get it on iTunes yeah. and they can get it on SoundCloud, and it's called the Angelos and Barry Show. Okay. So that's easy and to if, remember. If, if people are into zeitgeisty Chinesey stuff, yeah, they yeah. will enjoy it. Yes, they will. Be, be, they'll be right. It'll be right up their street. If they're you, into that stuff. You sound like you've just got very. You, you got very tired all of a sudden, Angelos. No, mate. I am full of energy. I've just had a big line of drugs. 
and you're doing a live show, which, of course, we don't condone. No, we don't condone it, but it does help. <sighs> we're doing a live show on Friday the 13th of May. Oh, unlucky for some. Yes. Unlucky for the, your audience. At the Adderbelly. Well, no, you I'm never know. The Adderbelly. Yeah. Bank. yes. Unlucky for your audience. Yeah. Um, and where you get tickets from, Barry? Uh, Adderbelly.co.uk. Unlucky for your audience. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know about know. that. Uh, oh, I don't think so. I don't think that applies to us. No. And then you're also doing a tour as well. Would you like to talk about yeah. that or not bothered? Yeah, no, we well, talk about that. Well, yeah, we're talking about that. It's in the autumn, okay. all around the country. All right, well, probably, all over the place. Probably best not to mention it now, then, because people will forget. They've got very short memories in show business. Well, yeah, but we can come back on this show. I don't... We keep talking about it. I don't think so. Um, <laughs> Barry, it's been nice talking to you. Bye-bye, old chum. Wh- who is that to? Both of you. Thank and you. And the man with the pencil up his bottom. OK, thank you. And it's, 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 it's certainly been 30 minutes, and I, I appreciate your oh. time. All right, mate. Well, I've enjoyed myself, actually. Don't say it so, so defiantly. I'm glad you have. Yeah, no, I have. I have done. Yes, on balance, it's been very good, yeah. Well, best of luck with the, best of luck with the shows. Thanks, mate. And then we say goodbye now. OK, all right. Well, look, have a good time. And, and that's it. Yeah, that's it. OK. Thank you. All right, mate. Lovely. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye, Angelos. Thank you. Bye bye. Cheers, mate. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye bye. Good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Ta ta. Bye bye. Thank you, Angelos. Yes, 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 yes. Bye. Good night, Angelos. Hello. No. Hello? No. 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 Night night, everybody. No night. Good night, Angelos. Hello. No. Can you put the phone down now, please, mate? Because we've got to clear the line for the show. Okay, all right. Bye bye. Ta ta. Okay. Bye-bye. That was Angelos Epithemate. Yes. No. He put the phone down. <clears throat> okay. Unmissable late night radio with the original king of unconventional conversation. Make contact with Ian Lee. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. Do you remember last week or the week before? We were talking to um, uh, a young gentleman, an entertainer by the name of Angelos Epithemiu. That was the Wednesday before the election. Was it really? What a strange memory you have for election date. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Angelo! Oh, how did, I've not introduced him. How did you know he was there? Psychic. Psychic, yeah. Angelo, you're there, aren't you? Yeah, so I'm here. I'm listening to every word of it. Right. OK. <laughs> it's a strange tone. And I thought it would be a bit of fun, Alan... Yeah. If we got Angelus back on yeah. to um, talk about the show that he did on Friday, Friday the 13th, Spooky. Yes. 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 Was yeah. Jason there? Yes. Was was Jason there, Angelos? Yes. Yeah, I, I'd have thought so. Yeah, Jason, yeah. Okay. He was, uh, yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah, definitely. I definitely remember seeing him there. Yes, yes. Okay. And I've never met him. No. And um, I thought it would be interesting, Alan, um, if no. if he yeah, if he told us how yeah. the show went because I had a few emails over the weekend. Oh, yeah, yeah, from yeah. From some people who um, were a little bit disappointed. Yeah, this is it. Hello, I'm here. Hello. How did my show go, Angelo? Oh, uh, you know, mate. Um, we went there with all the best intentions, you know. To do our talk all about Zeitgeist. guys, Zeitgeist. guys, and yes, and all the um, uh, what, the um, industrial dynamics in an emerging Chinese market. We went to do that, um, and the whole thing was a bit of a, a bit of a farce, you know. I've got an idea things. for your next show, Angela. Hey, I've got an idea for your next show. Oh, what was it? How about a bit of Hopkins Bingo? Because he's on tonight. Okay, well let's not let's not confuse Angelos with Hopkins Bingo, Alan. 
Which Hopkins Bingo? You heard of Casey Hopkins? Yes, I do know her. She's from um, this morning. Well, she got a show on another radio station at the moment. Okay. And we normally have two callers guessing what topics he's talking about. Right, okay. And what's she talking about tonight then? Well, I don't know, we have to guess. That's what you'd have to. That, if we were playing that now, Angelos, that's, that's what yeah. you'd have to guess. Jobs? Uh, I tell you what, right, Alan, I'm going to cut you off because you're annoying me. Okay. Yeah, okay. there we go. Took that very well, didn't he? Yeah, yeah, on the chin. <laughs> that frees up a line so I can then bring Barry in. Good evening, Barry. Hello. Oh, it's Barry from Watford. I didn't realise. Hello, Hello there. Barry. All right, Angelus. Hello, Barry. You all right, mate? Yeah, all right, mate. N- uh, yeah. Nice to speak to you, mate. Now, both yeah, of you, you too, mate. are sounding... Because you did your show on Friday, Friday the 13th. Yes. And yeah. you're both, you were both, when you came on to talk about it, you're both full of spunk. Yeah. Um, yeah, and well, we were up about it then, you know, we was, we were all uh, up for it and all uh, the rest of it. Yes. You know? Yeah, optimistic and we were. And now, yeah. and now you seem very down. So all the spunk has been drained from you. Yeah, well. Did someone we drain were, your spunk? Yeah. We were let, we were let, let down very badly by the audience, actually. Yeah, we we went out with all our spunk, and yeah. they and took a lot of our spunk, and uh, I feel spunkless now. You, s- <laughs> yeah. Oh, I mean, we were full of it. To be honest with you, we yeah, went we out there, and we were full of it, and then um, you s- and then we emptied it all out okay. there, and all on the stage, <laughs> all on the stage, etc. Was saying. You were saying, Angelos, yeah. that the audience let you down. That's unusual, because yeah, normally... So. Well, tell me, tell me why. What happened? What did they do wrong? Well, they, they all come along, and, you know, we're doing our stuff, trying to really tap into to the, the zeitgeist, zeitgeist, you know? Yeah. The zeitgeist, yeah. Yes. <laughs> but, mind you... We're trying to a... tap into that. But yeah. the thing is, though, the people what was in the audience didn't know what was on the zeitgeist. So they weren't tapping into it either. No. So I, there was a miscommunication. The, well, that's your job as the as the performers. That's your job to communicate. No, it's not. Oh, no, oh it's hold not. on. No, mate, it ain't. Well. No. No. It's up to the, the audience to know what is on the zeitgeist. Right. And yeah. to, be, to be in on it as well. It's, Otherwise, it's a losing game, isn't yeah. it? We, we're very much more of a happening than the performance. Yes. Can I read yeah. some, some of the emails from listeners oh, that Christ, bought, right, bought, bought tickets yeah. Yeah. based on your appearance on the show the other week? Oh, God, okay. go on. Uh, let me get these. Hang on a second. Let me get the emails up. Um, right. Um, Steve yeah. says... Yeah. I, are you still there? Yeah. Yes. You both there? Yeah. Steve, yeah. what do you say? What did Steve say? I'm just trying to find the... You're right. making this tell, up. Tell us, tell us what um, Matthew said. I know he was there. Yeah, that no, Jason, wasn't it? Jason was there, yeah. I didn't get an Sorry. email from Jason. I've got an email from Steve. Steve well, says... Spit it out. <laughs> what did Steve say? I'm, I'm just going to tell you. Steve said, okay. Ian, what? I've travelled... Okay. Go on. Go on then. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Is he gone? Oh, I know he... Or he may I'm have just, done, I'm, yeah. I'm just choking. On a zeitgeist. Steve right, says... What did Steve say and how far did he come from? I travelled over 150 miles on Friday the 13th. Yeah. Nottingham, that'll be. Nottingham. Yeah, that's from, about that. Yeah. From the Nottingham area. Well done, those guys. Yeah, there mm. you go. What did he think? Did you like it? <laughs> to see Angelos <laughs> and Barry. Yeah, what did he make yeah. of it, then? What, like? what did you think of the show? What out of five stars would he give us? Yeah. He I usually th- does a star rating to Steve. He's not given... Well, go easy normally, on this. Normally, normally does a star rating. He's not given a star rating. Oh. Oh, it's unusual. Yeah, for him. What did what he did like he about... What did he like about the well, show? Well, it would be... 
it, 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 it doesn't go into specifics about what he liked, Barry. Uh, generally, gen, gen, generally, generally, generally what he likes. Can generally, one of you, can, what Barry, you you're an old from the, the East End. Yeah. What does what does pony mean? Oh, pony and trap. Yeah. Well, it means it means not bad. How he got to the show is his own affair. What did he make of the actual show? He seems a curious way to get 150 he, miles on a pony and trap. It must have, no, it must have taken him four days. He'd yeah. have been knackered when he got there, so he would have been he, in a bad yeah, no mood. No wonder, yeah. He got there by car. He said the show was complete and utter pony. Pony. Oh, well, well I'm... Well, did you, Steve, go, did you Steve say what he was expecting? Yeah. He said he was expecting zeitgeisty stuff... Yeah, and, and that's what he got. And yeah. laughter, not an old man yeah. dressed up as the Pope. It was Mother Teresa, so up <laughs> yours. Yeah, exactly. Up yours, exactly. Yeah. And also, there was zeitgeist stuff in there, because we'd done all the stuff about the Chinese. Yes, we'd done Didn't stuff we? about ecology, about... Interesting. Yeah, Can Mr. I interrupt? New, new Green and Common, nuclear bombs, all this stuff. All this stuff. I've got an email. Yeah. NHS. From a gentleman called Wang. Oh, yeah, this is it, isn't it? Oh, here we go. This now, goes, finally, yeah. we, 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 he'll back us. He'll back Come us on, then. Wang, well, I know he loved it. He did love it. He says he found it a bit racist, particularly the yeah. chinese stuff. Yeah, yeah, well, Wang, Wang would say that, because he's <laughs> all like... Yeah, he's very much like that, he, Wang. He's very, very pretty, he correct his Wang. Yeah. And that's a shame, because he needs to loosen up a bit. He does. There's something yeah. wrong with Wang. <laughs> there is. I know. I know. Hello. I know. <laughs> Hello, Barry. I'm still here. Okay. I'm still here what's, too. What's Wang been saying about us? It's damn cheeky, isn't it? Well, he starts yeah. off. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Oh, yeah. Which is where he okay, ca- which is yeah. where he came from. All yeah, the way from okay. Harrow. Yeah. Um, oh, he just right. found the tone of it a little bit offensive. Well, he, he, he must have been watching the wrong show. Yeah, because we wasn't, we wasn't, wasn't like that at all. at all. No. Not one thing. We wasn't bit. like that at all. We were saying how much we were, we were in, actually into the Chinese. Okay, okay. I'm just going to... Oh, hang on a second. We've just lost Barry, which isn't necessarily a bad thing, but hang on. Um, we've Where's got, he gone? He's back. We've got si- Simon's called in to speak Hello, to you Barry. guys. Simon, were you at the show Hello, on Friday? Sir. Oh, I wasn't Simon? there. No, no, I wasn't. Why not? I mean, um, f- f- I missed. It sounds like I missed the treat with all the Chinese stuff uh, and yeah, the zeitgeist geez. stuff, which you know, zeitgeist. Where stuff were you I'm really into? He's asking you a question, uh, Simon. Please answer go it. On. Go on. What Where were you on Friday? Uh, well, uh, do you know, uh, the, the problem is, I know there are a lot of people listening. Well, a few people Please listening to this. I mean, and, it's um, a simple question, Simon. <laughs> Well, all oh, right, okay, okay, okay. Where were you on Friday night, what? Simon? What the hell is going on? Why can't you just going, answer the straight question? You're going, going right around the ashes. Simon, Going stop. right round the ashes. Come on, mate. I'll tell you where, where I was. You okay. Making out you're some sort of secret agent. Simon, where were, where you? were you like, on you Friday, secret Simon? Agent. Secret where were you on Friday? Exactly what, what's going on Simon, where, on, on Friday, Simon, very oh, simple oh, question, oh, where the oh, hell oh, were you? He's all like enigmatic now, isn't he? He's all enigmatic. Yeah, I don't know where I was, etc. Where were right. you on Friday, Simon? Okay, I've cut him off. I'm not having that. Right. Yes, Fair enough, mate. A simple question. Couldn't give where us was the man on Friday? N- nasty piece of work. Oh, wasn't he ghastly in the nasty, well, nasty piece of work. While we recover from Simon, can I just play a couple of quick adverts and we come back? Is that okay, chaps? Oh, God, all right. Yeah, all right, yeah. Thank you. We have ways of making you talk. Okay, look, well, uh, this is Ian Lee, Talk Radio, 0844 499 Join from, uh, join with, with Barry from Watford. Hello. And Angelos, Angelos, we don't quite know where you're from. Leeston. Huh? Leeston. Le- Leeson. Neeston. 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 Neeson. Neeston. 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 Neeston.
his knee, knees and, and toes. His knees them. Shoulderton. And the knees them. Hold on, I'm just going to finish my pork ball. Do you like it there? Yeah, do yeah. Yeah, it's gone down now. We we sold out though. There's a lot of Apparently, you did. did. Yes, and that's part yeah. of the problem. A lot of people come to the show loads and it's sold out. Yeah, what was loads, yeah. what was what yeah. was well, how many? Four hundred and twenty. Four hundred and twenty. How yeah, much were the yeah. tickets? Don't know. Oh, back, back. <laughs> About 20 quid, I think. So, 40, yeah, 20. Yeah, 30, about 20 pounds, yeah. Times, uh, that's, that. so that's about eight and a half thousand pounds. Yeah. Lovely. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I'm assuming you've declared that to the authorities. Yeah, of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah absolutely, you cleared up. I phoned yeah. the police up and told them. There were some people who paid for extra, like, VIP seats. What did they yeah, get for that? Yeah, roped off area. Well, they're in a roped off area, rope and afterwards they're allowed to come in the dressing room and meet, meet us and we'll shake hands. Okay. Yeah, shake hands. Okay. Yeah. So Sign the, they can watch us. They can watch us get changed as well yeah. for another twenty because they see his bottom. That's a t- on top. So a, yeah, it was a, a disaster. Yeah. Yeah. But we made a lot of money, and someone got the money, bottom, and which is yeah. a boon. We got we... <laughs> okay. There's a tour that's going to take place. When is that? September, October? Yeah, yeah, that's it. October, October, November. Okay, and it's going to cr- all yeah. across the country. Yeah, yeah. What lessons? Let's start with you first, Angelos. What lessons yeah. have you learned from Friday night for the rest of the tour? Uh, I think. Well, Probably learn to pick our audience a bit better. Um, not only let in the people that really understand what's going on there around here nowadays. And if we do that, then we should have a show that we think we've got rather than the map that we put out on Friday. Yeah. Okay. So, Barry, apart from choosing, selecting your audience, what, what lessons yeah. have you learnt, Barry? Well, I think it's as um, Jonathan Miller, Dr. Jonathan Miller said when he was directing one of his operas. Yeah. And yeah, I'm quoting him yes. verbatim, don't come on with a load of muck no. and yeah, it's poorly on. rehearsed and then invite people back for an extra few quid to see your bottom. No. Because okay. it will... Yeah, yeah. Not so it'll get out. It'll get out. Um, it'll get out. It'll get out around the community. Yeah. So we we're, we're gonna try and write something that people will like would be a star. <laughs> uh yeah. and then we're so gonna we'll order ca- we'll, we'll just tap into like more more stuff that people Don't say are it. Into. Don't yeah. say Zeit don't say no. Zeitgeist. Um, I don't we're think not you know. gonna invite no. Steve Wang or Jason. Okay. I can All right. Well, listen, off. it's been nice to talk to you again, guys. Um, yeah. the, the podcast... I feel bad that you sound so down, Angelos. No, don't worry about it, mate. It's, I'm not down at all. I'm, I'm buzzing, actually. Okay. Could you sound like you're buzzing? Yeah, I'm buzzing. That's better. Uh, the podcast, where, where can people get hold of that? Uh, on the computer. Okay. That's oh, a it, great plug. It's on the iTunes called the Angelos and Barry Show. Okay, yeah, there's a lot yeah, of yeah, filthy yeah. muck. Angelos Barry Show. Yeah, yeah. yeah. we uh, we last time you were on Barry, we asked you a question. I don't think we got an answer. Oh, go on, shoot from it. So I'm yeah. going to ask you the question now, if that's all right. Maybe okay. we can get a, an answer. Okay, don't. And it might prompt a little bit of fun banter with the callers and stuff. Oh, cool. cool. Yeah, go on. Okay. Okay. okay, just asking Barry Angelos. Oh. Well, you, well have a, I, you have a think. You might be able to come up with an answer for it. I on. definitely will. I so, definitely will. Barry, if you had to enter an animal... OK. <laughs> Don't miss again. What animal would you enter and why? I think I, I definitely answered I, this I, question. I, I asked, answered it. I so said you should laugh because it had a very tall neck and it wouldn't have to look over its shoulder and look at you with disdain. It'd be up yeah, there. I think, you just, I think you just say that. 
I did say that. Yeah, I think you did. That, that Mind really you. Did. You might have said that, actually, yeah. I did yeah, say did that. Giraffe. Oh, I've got a feeling you did say giraffe. I, I did say giraffe. Yes. I can change it. Go on, then. What would your second choice for an animal to enter be? A chihuahua in suspenders. Oh. Hello? How about that? How about that? <laughs> How about that, then? How about that? And have you know, had a little think about that, Barry, since the last show? I have, yeah, most nights. Yeah. Very yeah, specific yeah. answer. Angelos, what would, you, what would you enter? Dolphin. Yeah? Yeah, mate. On purpose. Yeah, yeah purpose. The thing, the thing, you see, the thing for me, Ian, is it's all about the chase. And I yes. think, I mean, you, I mean, you'd be hard put to catch one of them. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, you, you really would have to want to do it. Yeah. So, yeah. you have to, you know, you'd have to give it a good old chase, you know? Yeah. 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 And right. that, that would really, really get it, really do it for me, yeah. All right. Well, guys, it's been, it's been a pleasure talking to one of you. I'm not going to say which one. Okay, thanks. Okay. Thanks, mate. See, see you tomorrow, Angelos, for the podcast. Oh, yeah, definitely. I'll be there. I'll be there. Okay. 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 Bye. 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 ta Bye, mate. Bye. ta mate. Bye. Okay. Bye. 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 Hello? Bye, Angelos. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh. No. Hello? Bye-bye, yeah. Angelos. Oh, okay, yeah. Bye. Okay. Well, that was Angelos... And Barry there. Um, <clears throat> I don't know. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. Come here. Hang on. Who's, Nikki, are you still there? Yeah, I'm still there. I heard a third voice. Hello? Who's there? Hello? Hello? Excuse me? Who's that? Who's, who's that? Who's that? Who's that? That's all fucking you. Lee, is that you? Right. Um, what is this? This is the Ian Lee show. Yes, it's in the Ian Lee show, but who are you? Uh, yeah. Yes, well, who are you? Well, I'm Alan, first call of the night. Uh, what are you ringing about, call? Alan? Well, I don't know, Ian, I haven't asked me yet. Oh, right, so you just rang up on spec. To make sure that he asked you what you wanted, yeah? Yeah. But okay. he hasn't asked me yet, because he asked Nicky, who was too nervous to call, but he has called, but he's calling number two, and you're calling number three. Okay, well, that's the logistics of it all. Fantastic. Lovely. What do you want to speak about? I don't know. Because what do you want to talk about? Brexit. Um, uh, we're not doing the EU referendum. I am. I'm doing it. Well, are you in or are you out? Right, no, I, right, right. Angelos, hang on a second. You're the. Th- is that Angelos? Yes, it's you... Angelos, yes. Calimera? Hello? Calimera? Yes, yes. Ticaris? Calimera, yes. Yes, yes. You've been trolling yes. me online tonight, haven't you? Ah. Oh. I've been trolling you, mate. I've been trying to get you engaged in the conversation, a debate, and trying to get your opinion on something, but you're very reluctant to, uh, to express any sort of opinion. You've, you've, um, how can I ring in? I need to talk about Brexit. Yes. I won't be silenced on Brexit. I won't be. Will you be? I won't will be. You be sh- I won't right. be, but you, I will be silencing you on Brexit. Oh, right, well, okay. Well, let's find out, isn't it? Are you in or are you out? And then the next one... Oh, Al- well, I got right, I got <laughs> Alan! So, I so, so, apologise for my dad language. Who did your dad, was that your dad effing, uh, using the F word? Yeah. Flipping heck. We're having a... Oh. Nicky, are you still there? I'm still here. Um, Sorry if I'm quiet. Um, uh, hello, Nicky. Just, just a bit nervous. Hello. He, Nicky's oh, nervous, man. Angelos. Go, Jen. Just, just, you know. Don't worry, Nicky. What, did you enjoy uh, Herring and uh, Lee tonight, Nicky? Very, very much so, yes. Where did you go and see that? That was in uh, Leicester Square. 
Kayan ama işte kim tarihi? Oh, I can't remember. Can I get it on my iTunes? Yeah, right, Alan, I'm going to cut you off. Okay. That was easy. Yeah. Nice You're... fight there. Next, next. How much did you pay, Nicky? Um, it was somewhere around fifteen pound plus. But yeah, two. I thought that's what you would have paid to see that. Yeah. yeah. Have you been on the Richard Herring podcast, Angelos? You won't have me. You won't have me on there, mate. No, exactly. Yeah, it's no, class. No. Top act. Uh, yeah. No, no, be, yeah. no because no? he is yeah. intimidated by me in the same way that you is intimidated by him. But yet you're intimidated by me. So that's like that nah. picture of the stairs that go up but down at the same time. That's it. No. Yeah, Escher. Bless you. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> next, next tweet. Next tweet. You go on in. So this is a this is addressed to me. Did you tell me, yeah. Nick, if you think this is trolling or not? At, at Ian Lee, yes. you're just yes, you're just a mouthpiece for the puppet masters. Well, I think you are. Nicky, what do you reckon? Is that trolling? Uh, just a little bit, yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, you think that's trolling, is it, Nicky? Just a little bit. You give me your Twitter address, mate. I'll show you what trolling is. No, don't you dare! <laughs> I actually okay. barely right. use Twitter anymore. Oh, well, because you got trolled? No, I just got bored of it. Yeah, no, fair enough, mate. Uh, I found that I was uh, speaking to nobody in particular. Well, that's Angelos. Yeah. That's Angelos every time he steps on stage. Oh, there we go. Another one. How did you get on tonight, then, uh, with Richard Herring? Yeah, brilliantly. I loved it. I loved it. I got loads of laughs, and everyone loved me. What, what did you talk about? Um... Did you go out of your comfort zone? I got very close to the edge of it. Did you? Mm. Did you? And where is the edge of your comfort zone? What sort of subject? It's just kind of right. near um, my th- my anus. Yes, that's what I thought you'd result to all that. All it body stuff and the stuff. balm and that. Thank you, Nicky. Hmm. So, do you want to take it on with Brexit with me? To me? No, not you, Nicky, no, no. I know that you're out. Right. The thing is, Angelos... Yes. Uh, it's really boring. What is? Brexit. Oh, yeah. Listen, mate, this is the biggest ever decision you will ever make. OK? Like, you have got to vote whether or not to be in it or whether <laughs> you can <laughs> go out of it. I know what it is. I know, yeah. I know. Yeah, I know what it is. Well, a lot of people don't know it. Yes, they do. Uh, they go. Hello. <laughs> Hello, they do. You're saying that there are some people who don't know that, 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 yes. what, that they can vote in or out of Europe, and those are the choices. There's loads of people that don't know about that. Who? Well, Keith up the road doesn't know. Does he not? No, he doesn't know, though, because I told him to listen to this. Now he knows. But there's like, loads of people like that that don't know. Um, and if you, what you, you have to register online to vote, um, whether or not you go in, the, um, to Europe or, or not. Or, yeah. So, but it's, but it's, the thing is, Angelos, right? Yeah. It's boring. It's, what was that? Huh? Yeah. It's boring. Yeah, you're boring. I'm going to ignore that. Okay. And it's on all the other radio stations. I bet. And now it's on this one. Well, no, I don't... Join the club. I don't want to join the you're club! In, you're in Brexit now. No, I don't want to join... No, I'm not. I don't want All to right. join right. the club of okay. that talks about... But I, okay. I bet if we go to LBC okay. right now, right, yeah. I bet... Yeah, Katie Hopkins. No, it's not Hopkins. It's um, Ian Collins, right? What are the chances of having two presenters on at the same time of night? Both called Ian. Ian. Yeah. Uh, about 25 to 1. Okay, so that's, that's lower than I thought, yep. But still worth, yeah. a, still worth a punt. Worth a punt, yeah, Labbrooks. Let's get, or, or um, um, yeah, pa- Paddy, Paddy, uh, Paddy Power. Uh, uh, Coral, William Hill, any of them. Any of them. Near um, the Turf Accountants. Let's have a little listen to, this is, this is LBC. Um, well. That, that bit wouldn't have been a biblically referenced, would it? 
No, 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 right. that's, that's not a big So that's just become a kind of contemporary that's interpretation. Easy. No, they're not talking about Brexit, they're talking about Muslims fasting, Muslims fasting for Ramadan, so... Uh, Ramadan. 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 That's it, mate. I said it first. Yeah, but only because you uh, knew I was going to say it. You only anyway. said it after I started saying it. Yes, mate. All right, ghosts, then, if you don't want to talk about Brexit. <laughs> How have you made the leap from Brexit to ghosts? Everyone makes the leap from Brexit to ghosts. <sighs> it's, the next, it's the go-to subject. Right, stay there. I'm going to play an advert. St- shush, shush. Party. Button it. Stay there. Come back in a minute. <laughs> Evening, this is Ian Lee, Talk Radio, 0844 499 1000. Uh, Nikki's on the line. Evening, Nikki. Evening, hello. And uh, Angelos has, um, is, well, you're, you're basically trolling the listeners now, Angelos. Okay. Well, no, it's not okay. I kind of feel you you owe them an apology. Sorry, everyone. But without the sarcasm, without the sarcasm. Okay, yeah, sorry, guys. Really sorry about trolling all of your listeners, all three of them. And then, yeah. do you know what? It was really nice until that last little bit at the end, but I'm going to ignore that because I'm a bigger man than you. Yeah, okay. You're welcome. Okay. You want yeah. to talk about ghosts? Yes, I do, actually. Okay, yeah. fine. Have you, have been, you, smoke, have you been smoking drugs tonight? No, I've not. I've, I normally suck on my bong, but tonight I haven't done it uh, because I knew I had to come on here and deliver a very powerful speech about Brexit. But you've tried to silence me, um, but I still haven't smoked anything. But, I bet you've sucked on something tonight. Right. Uh, what was that? I think... So, okay, uh, come on then. <laughs> what? Come on then, what? Oh, a ghost, isn't it? Yes. Is this part of the zeitgeists? Yes, it is. It's all, everyone's banging on about ghosts at the moment. Who? Um, all the people. Um, what, have Post-wise. you seen one? No, because they don't exist. Oh, says you. Yeah, well, yes, I do. Cause they, I, I've uh, seen one. Okay, why don't you tell us um, about... W- would you like me to play some spooky music to slightly detract no, from your don't point? Don't worry about uh, No, don't worry no. about that. No? I, I saw one at the Odeon. The Hammersmith Odeon? No. Uh, it was uh, Colchester. The Colchester Odeon, you saw a ghost. Why don't you tell us about that? This is uh, Casper. The, the movie? Yeah. No. I saw a ghost once. Where? It was the ghost of that joke, because I just saw it die and disappear up to heaven. Oh, right. Well, that's how you're treating your customers, is it? <laughs> I mean, what do you expect from that? That's worse material than Barry comes up with. I saw a ghost. Oh, God, where did he come from? I saw a ghost. Would you look in the mirror? Oh, that's All right, right isn't it? All right, Hello, Barry. Barry. Yes, All right, mate. mate. Yes. Thanks for ringing in, mate, because this bloke is an handful, isn't he? Absolutely. He's yeah, it very rude, actually. It <laughs> was a dark night. Yeah, it was I know windy. It, it was windy outside. I'd just gone up to bed to take a bit of... a little bit of hot milk, malted milk, to my wife, Margaret. She yeah. liked it in bed, although it did stick to her moustache a bit. If she dribbled it down her chin, and you know, and she looked like Colonel Sanders, you know, with her yeah. malted milk. Yeah. F- finger licking good. Not, who's, who's not a military man, can I just say? No, he's not. And she, not. But she is... I believe he was a slave owner. Yeah, he wasn't really? a military man, though. No. Yeah. Colonel Sanders, he never, he never served anywhere. No, well, except in his uh, the fine KFC restaurants. He, 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 no, he, he never served now. He was a right chicken. He was, he really was. He um, a chicken. Suddenly, as I looked at my, this is the story. I'll go back to the story. Yeah. Okay. So, 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 I give Margaret oh, a dear. Mold. I give Margaret. Oh dear. A, I'll give Sounds like Mar- you're leaning backwards. I give Margaret. That's better. A, I that's give better. My... So all I'm saying is that's better. I Go. Give my... In your I own give... time. <laughs> I give Margaret a malted milk. 
it went on her top lip. Always a laugh, you know, and that. Suddenly I heard a noise. A ghost had come in. Where? Huh? Up through the bog? Yeah, come up through the bog. You know, like that snake come up and that man yeah. is, um, he you know, dingle, dingle dangle. It yeah. was like that come up through the toilet. Come up through the bog, it goes. They do do that. Well, I've heard they do do that. Well, they, because it's the easiest way in, they come up through the sewers. And then up it through is. the bog. And then, yeah. like, if you get, if you can get possessed by them because a lot of them ghosts go up through your bum, you know? Yeah, well, this one come up near my bum, you know, as I was sitting on the toilet. I said, what the hell are you doing? Victorian gentleman, he was. I thought Can you we... were delivering... I thought you were giving Margaret some milk. Sorry, Angelos knows I then went to the toilet. I didn't turn that bit, did I? I left that out. So I'm sat on the, uh, the toilet sort of thing, and this Victorian ghost come up, <laughs> carrying an old oil lamp. <laughs> well... Oh. I tell you something, with the methane in there, the combination could have been lethal. Anyway, he says, oh, excuse me, and he said, is um, Lord Timothy in? Well, I know for a fact that my house is built on an old, uh, ma- you know, ancient mansion site. Yeah, yeah, this is, where's this, in Watford? Eh? In Watford? Yeah, the Watford mansion. Is it, was the Watford mansion in the bushy area? Yes. So was this fellow when he come up between the legs and all. Anyway, <laughs> he's yeah, also really on a Native American um, Indian burial ground as well, isn't it? Your house is built. Oh, tell him what, when you saw that ghost around oh my God, house, the Indian don't. fella, the yeah, red no, Indian. Big, oh, well, I was I was just making a, a pot noodle in the kitchen, wasn't I? Yeah, yeah, and I just put the um, I just put all the water into the pot, and I'd gone up a bit, a bit. I'd gone a bit too much over the... <laughs> over the top, much over, yeah. Over the line, didn't I? Yeah, you that's know? it. And oh, sure I enough... Thought, oh, I thought, oh, Christ, I'll have to get rid of some of that water, you know. Mm, so I went yeah. over to the sink, and I was just start pouring, pouring, pouring the water down the sink, because I put too yeah. much in the noodle. The power of water. The, yeah, and I heard, I heard this, I heard this, oh, mm. yucka, oh, um, yeah, like yeah. noise. Like that. I thought, what's that? Who's that? You know, yeah. And I'll pour a bit more water down the plug. I'll say, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. <clears throat> anyway, yeah. this uh, septa spirit type thing. That's it. Comes up, comes up through your sink. The plug hole. Yeah, up, that's it. Up through the plug hole. And he says, mm. listen, mate, as I said, listen, I'm Geronimo. And he has a big action again. Like, is your that's ghostly? Because it. it's like midnight. Um, mm. He says, I'm Geronimo. And I'm a, I'm a ghost. And I live uh, on the Native American burial ground here. Um, yeah. Don't pour your water down this hole because you're going to burn someone, you know? That's and it. I, I didn't think nothing of it because I've been chucking uh, on my bong that night, you know? Yeah. And then he went back down in the plug hole and that's the last I ever heard of him. And so I spoke to you about it and you said, you know, yeah, he's been knocking around. Oh, well, well, he's been knocking around for right. ages. Can you just, can you just finish what? what you were saying? Oh, well, basically I farted and he disappeared back down the toilet. In my case. I think we've mm. got... It's funny enough you should mention that. What what noise did it make? <laughs> like that standard fart noise. Not you. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. The ghost. Yeah, what noise did the ghost make? <laughs> oh. No. <laughs> yeah. He <didn't> <laughs> like this... He just come up through the... <laughs> this... He just come up through the bog and went... <laughs> Is this really what we've... <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> it... No. No. Please. Please. No. I meant... <laughs> oh, sorry. Ange lost his pot noodle. <laughs> no. The ghost. No. Oh. What did he do, Angelos? What noise did he make? <laughs> Angelos, is it gone? I think we have a recording of it here. Hang on. Hang on. Tanya Mata Hawaka, Tangai Hangai Kawaiu, Ayuta Mati Apoka Ai, When You Are Kaitan, Natayu. Was that it? <laughs> was, was that it? I think so, yeah. Uh, well, I think Angelos is gone, which is. Oh, uh, well, he's gone. He's been spooked. 
I'm going to go now. Please. <laughs> Please do. No, no. I... No, I, Barry, thank you. No, no, no. No, no. And thank you, um, thank you. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. So you believe it? No, I... Do yeah. I believe what? Hang on a minute, who's that? Hello? 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 Who's this? Who's this? This, this is Ian Lee, who's, who's this? this? Who's, this is Ian Lee, who's this? Do you know who this is? Have, hello, <laughs> uh, hello, caller? Hello? Hello, caller? Hello? Calling occupants. Go on. What? Are you there? Yeah, I'm talking to Jez. Who's that? Who are you talking to Jez? Are you talking about um, <laughs> aliens and that? <laughs> Hello? Who was that? <laughs> Hello, Jez? Hello? Hello, mate. How are you? Yeah, you okay? On. Hello? Hello, Jez. Oh, jeez. Hello? Hello, mate. You all right? On. Yeah, fine, mate. Thank you. How are you? Yeah, I'm okay. Are you talking about p- the aliens and the pyramids as well? No, all I'm doing is I, I'm just putting a, just putting a, a question forward. That's all I'm doing. Yeah. What is it? Yeah. So, that do you believe, as many um, educated people do, that aliens have visited yeah. before? Yes. 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 I have. Yes. 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 Definitely. Yes, I have proof. You have proof, how? There's something in my back garden. (laughs) (laughs) Say what? There's something in my back garden. Then why in your back garden? There's something in it, in the garden. There's something in your back garden. Yeah. Okay. Ian? It's definitely not, it's definitely not from round here. It's definitely not. It must have up from somewhere, and it's definitely not from here. Definitely, I've had it what checked it? out. What, what's what? your name, mate? Angelos. Angelos. What? What is it in your back garden? I don't know what it is, but it's definitely not from round here. I've had a look yeah, on the internet. What, what? What? What makes you think it's not from round here? Well, because there's nothing else around here. What looks like it? Well, what is? What does it look like? It's just this lump of muck. Ellen Pamuk. Okay. Yeah. And I don't know. Yeah. If it's definitely not from an animal. <laughs> yeah, have you gone? <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what do you mean? It's like a lump of muck. It's not like a lump of muck. It is, it is a lump of muck, but not like normal muck. <laughs> what does it look like? Well, like it's, un- un- it's ungainly. <laughs> it's ungainly. <laughs> oh, my Lord. Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. It must be from outer space then. That's what I'm saying to you. That's what I'm trying to explain to you. Oh, stop it. If you come round and have a look at it, then <laughs> you seem to be some sort of expert. <laughs> stop it, mate, please. You're <laughs> killing me. Oh, my lord. Oh, yeah. Excuse me. <laughs> Do you believe in aliens? You sound like yeah, you yeah. <laughs> Oh, Lord. Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah I do. Why do you believe in yeah. them? Have you ever had something in your garden? <laughs> yeah, that's in my garden. Yeah, piece of muck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Anyway. So, so. Okay. Okay, then. Well, that's proof, then, isn't it? That's proof. That's proof, then, isn't it? It's smoke. You get back again. Get on, Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. What were you talking about before, Ainge? Maybe I can help you with that as well. 
<laughs> Internet. <laughs> oh, God. Internet. <laughs> Ian, there he wow. goes. No, I don't know where he is. Don't worry about him. <laughs> don't worry about him. No, don't worry about him. No. Mm, okay. You was talking about the internet, was it? He was, yeah. Not me. Well, you, what was you doing then? I was, <laughs> I was just asking <laughs> about aliens and that. Is that what you rung in for about the aliens? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. I rung in about the pyramids. <laughs> well done, mate. Okay. Uh, Hope that okay. answers your question, Jez. Thanks for calling. Jesus. That was an answer to his question. That was a lovely. Uh, if it, uh, are you happy to take any more questions from the callers, Angelos? I'll say all your questions. You can sit back and have a fag. O- okay. If you've got okay. a question for Angelos. Oh, wait, what's the number, Angelos? I don't know. That's a question. First well, question. I don't know the answer to that one. First question, and um, we, it's... OK. Well, you'll have to answer that one. I don't know it. Well, why don't you ask me? What is your number to ring in on? Oh, 0844 499 1000. If you've got a question for Angelos that doesn't involve numbers. <sighs> I'm not good with that, but I can do most other things. Speak to you after this. Oh wait, four 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 nine nine one thousand. Sorry, mm. I've um, I've mm. we've not had any callers. Oh right. That's a, but we've got a couple of callers that had called up before you. So oh, okay. they might they you might be able to help you might be able answer to help them. answer them. Let's go. T- do you want Ben or Gatford first, Angelos? Gatford. He's quite a boring caller. Yeah, go on, put him on. He's quite dull. Yeah, put him on. He's a very dull man. Yeah, excuse him. Thanks for that. Yep, oh. great intro. There we go. Yep. Gafford. An- Angelos. Angelos, nice to speak to you. Yeah. Oh, yes. yes. Um, th- th- I've got a question. Is your I'm name Gafford? Well, yeah, legally. Really? Now. Yeah. Is your name got Angelos? Changed. Got it changed by team. my name, yeah, Angelos. Legally? Oh, legally, yeah, legally. Is yeah. your name Ian Lee? changed by... Oh. <laughs> Oh. Yeah. Um, oh. My question is, how can I become a less boring caller? What can some, is there something well, in the zeitgeist that can help me? Yeah. Well, what did you? What were you going to call in about? Well, to, I was going to talk about a, a pro of the internet and how it can encourage like kindness of strangers. I've got an example of how a stranger had been really kind to me on the internet. No, well, no that's no good at all. That's all right. very, right. very turgid area, all that oh. stuff. You need to be more dramatic <laughs> and think up things, what will get you on the front cover of the papers. Like, so, so if you said... Give me something. Thank you, I'm, I'm speaking, thank you. Oh, so if you said, um, like, you had a terrible medical condition, for I example, do. you you know, like, if you had one ball bigger than the other, or... I nearly died with recently. your bum. What? I nearly died recently, thanks to a foot problem. A foot problem? Yeah. Did someone stick their foot in your mouth and you choke on it? No. That, that could well, what, else, I mean, what else could it have been? Well, I hurt my foot. And you nearly died from it? Well, maybe. But carry on. What, what other you see, the thing is, Gatford, I don't believe what you're saying. I think you need to be more confident. I think uh, that's where your problem is. You sound really like... Uh, what's the word? Yeah, like weak, you know. Ah, oh, what 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 can I do then? What 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 should I do? Should you I go need and... to like be stronger in yourself and have more confidence in what you're saying. Because at the moment you sound like like you don't care and you don't like believe in yourself at all. So, have you have you got a, a woman in your life? No. Thanks. No, well, this, no, well, that does, that, 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 I'm oh. not surprised, because they aren't oh. attracted to your sort of person. You see, oh. you need to get stronger, and then if you get a woman, then that will help you in that area as well. 
could, could I role play a bit of a conversation with you to help me get stronger? Could I? Could you be me? Yeah. yeah. And I'll be. Okay, I'll be on the phone. I'll be you. I'll be and, you. And I'll, and I'll be Ian Lee, and I'll, I'll answer the phone. Hi, Catford. Uh, what have you called in to say? Oh, uh, um, I thought I talk to you about the internet. Okay. What do you want? What, what about the internet? Huh? What, what about the internet? I'm being Ian Lee, so I should slightly probably be a bit more obnoxious or something, you know. Uh, what, what you got for us? Uh, what, the internet? Yeah, what, what, what about the internet? Well, I don't know. I've, um, there's all stuff on it. You know? Yeah, you, you're, you're a bit of a ball in calling, uh, Gatford. Uh, I'm going to cut yeah, you off I now. Know. Yeah, see, okay. that didn't go very well. He just still cut me off. No, but that's what, that's what you're like. But I want you to be a stronger version of me. Goodness sakes, you're so turgid. Turgid, isn't he? Very, very turgid. Shall I get rid of him? Get rid of him. Okay, he's gone. Hey, listen. Uh, Lee. Sorry? Are you there? Are you there? Yes, Epithomeo. Dick Ennis? Listen to me. Dick Ennis? Listen to me, okay? Calimera? Are you listening? Are you listening to me? Calamaris? Okay. Who to telephone on You listen to me, okay? Yes. You said about the pyramids, so. didn't you? You said, how did they make the pyramids? Didn't you? Yeah, you did. Right? Well, how they made them was they got a bit of rock and an hammer, and then they... Chiseled these big square bits out of these rocks, and they stuck them on top of each other. Mm. There's no mystery. Right, the rocks. It's just hard work. Oh, the rocks yes. came from about a thousand miles away. How do you explain yes. that? They put they put it in their cars, their ancient uh-huh. Egyptian cars, and got yeah. camels to pull it. They stuck it on their coach. They did what? And then they stuck it on the coach. What? And they and they drove him drove them down there. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Why have you been trolling me? Trolling you? I think actually it's the other way round. You're the one issuing threats and telling me you wasn't there, like you in a Chinese voice. It wasn't the Chinese. How can you have a oh. voice when you're typing? Well, you done it like a Chinaman, didn't you? I, I didn't. didn't mean that there. That I, sort of thing. I didn't. I wrote sorry with uh, R's. Uh, Mr. Lin or there. Ben, have you got a question for Angelos before I, I, I punch him in the nose? Uh, no, I don't. But uh, I got... I, uh, in... Um, I'm running up about the internet about one thing that I find is a bad thing. Yes. Um, what I find about the internet is sometimes when you use the internet, it's always so slow and slow. never as quick and and it never works properly and sometimes you've got to reboot everything and it's so annoying, you know, and they also put stupid things on the internet as well, like we about go. celebrities and stuff. Why do they need to put all silly things about celebrities and about who's given birth? Mm. And, you, you know, what, what's the point about all of that? That's a good point, isn't it, Angelos? Yeah, great point, actually. What would you like to see on the internet, uh, Ben? Well, well, you know, more people like getting on, you know, more people getting on, more people... Uh, mm. Not like doing their dirty washing in public all yeah. the time. A lot of people do oh, their dirty God. washing in public. Like yeah, a lot of people do for that. For Facebook and uh, you know, a lot yeah. of people do their dirty washing on public. That's how arguments are. What's the point of doing all of that? You know, it's more better just to be polite on the internet rather than you know doing all of your dirty washing on public. Yeah. Okay. He's- okay, mate. Is there nowhere on the internet where you can find people that are doing that rather than washing their stuff? Um, yeah, well, I go. I talk to my family and stuff on Skype, which is better. That's yes. one thing I find good about the internet. Um, yes, and that's free as well. Let's not forget yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. 
Because this costs money going on the phone, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Well, you can get, yeah. well, it doesn't always. You can get, um, you get credit with lots of phone deals, so. Oh, yeah. You? Yeah, you get credit, yeah, free credit. So you, you, you can yeah. talk for, you know, like a thousand minutes a month or something. Oh, well, that's good. Well, yeah, I mean, they yeah, say the world's yeah. getting worse, but there's all sorts of evidence to say that it's getting better, you know? Kettles, yeah. you, for example, used to be terrible. They used to be, like, just old tin things, yeah. you know, and they used to take ages to boil and that. And now they, they're plastic and you don't have to have all that mucky wire around and that. And you just yeah, lift yeah. it out of a cradle thing, you know? So yeah. things are getting better, thankfully. Yeah. Yeah, the technology has changed in the days, uh... Um, I've noticed things are getting a lot better these days. Yeah. 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 Good. All right, Ben. Well, thank you for that. Uh, well, I've, added, I've, added, I've, added, I've added it to the list. Yeah. Thank you, mate. Thank you. Thanks, thank Ben. You. Thanks, Ben. Take care. Good night. Oh, eight four 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 nine nine. One thousand. One thousand. That's it. Um, what do you want? Well... I have... You're doing some live shows with Barry from Watford. Yeah, I am, actually. Yeah, and he has asked... You can find out about it by going to www.barryfromwatfordandangelosdoingsomecrappylive.show.com. Um, yeah, that's your website. That's it. Shut up. Yep. Yeah. And he has told me... Live Nation tickets, Live Nation tickets. Yeah, that's if you want to go you and see... get the tickets. ...a good act. He has told me that oh. you're struggling to sell... Yes. A lot of tickets in a lot of markets. Um, yes. And so he's asked me, yeah. I'm sure you're aware of this, he's yeah. asked me to come and... There's some of the shows where the tickets aren't selling. He's asked me to come yeah. and be the opening act. Yeah, that's it. Yep, to come and, you know, it's just to... So you can put my yeah, name... No, but I'm ringing up to find out what he, is exactly what you're going to say. When? On... When? When you, when you come and do these things. Oh, it'll be, um, I'll, I'll, I'll probably, um, be singing my new single. Okay. What is it? Um, it's called, uh, Miley Cyrus. Oh, the old Miley Cyrus one. Have you heard it? No. Do you want to hear it? Yeah. Get ready, Angelos. Here it comes. Here it comes. Here we go. The musical vibe. Sing the song or two. Coming at me, Miley Cyrus, I now sitting there strumming away in front of me. Miley playing with the guitar, playing it hard. Miley Cyrus doing it styling now. Miley Cyrus, here she come now with the guitar. Ooh, doing it styling, Miley. Doing it styling. She playing guitar and strumming in front of me, Miley. So I'll probably open with that, Angelos. Blimey. Well, that's good, because that song goes on for ages. So that means we won't have to do as much time, which is good. Well, no, well, that's, well, that's a bit, uh, you think it goes on for, t- that's only halfway through it. That's what I mean. Wow. It's already gone on a long time. Wowzers. Okay. So I'll be doing yeah. that, and then yeah. I'll probably do, um... Will you so- do some of your spoken words? I was gonna do so. yes, I was gonna do some of my spoken words. Some of your spoken words? I'd, yeah, I was gonna do some spoken words. You some spoken word. I was gonna do some spoken word, yeah. Okay, how much of a spoken word are you going to do? 
Pardon? Pardon? How much, how much of your spoken word are you going to do? Just about five minutes. Five minutes of spoken word? And then that's like five minutes of the Marley Shirey song. Yep. All right, that we're getting somewhere. Then I thought I'm I might... Five more minutes out of you. Well, I can do two minutes of improv. Mm, okay. Huh? Yeah? That's a fool, you Dangerous. Mm, dangerous. Dangerous, dangerous. Very da- I like... Very dangerous. No safety net underneath that tightrope. Yeah, well, you're a bit volatile as well. So I, I don't know. It could be dangerous. Could be dangerous. Mm, okay. Could okay, be dangerous. Okay. okay. Um, and then I thought for the last three minutes, mm. um, I could do an audition piece. Oh, lovely. A bit of Shakespeare. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, similar to the spoken word, but um, it would be more emoted. Yeah. Okay. Does that sound okay, all right, all Angelos? Right. Yeah, yeah, that's okay. Yeah, that's okay. You can come. Oh, thanks very much. And it and um, Barry said I'd be getting five hundred pounds a night. Yeah, no, that's not true. He's just done that to you know to, to try and try and get you to come, but that you won't be getting that. I think I will. I think you will. That's what we agreed. That's what the contract well, says. I think you will. Listen, I'm going to send you a contract via my lawyers, uh, and then you can sign it, send it back, and then and then we'll, um, you know, that's that'll be it. That'll be sealed then. I've well, I've signed a contract that Barry wrote for me. Right. Okay. So well, I want to have a look at that. Okay. Fine. Absolutely fine. Okay. Well, I'm going to go now. Would you like to apologise to the boys and girls listening? No. Well, no. you've no. yes, you've you have no. sucked the no. life out of the first forty-five minutes of the show. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. 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 That's a that's a bad thing. No, it's not. It's yes, a good it thing. is. Yes. 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 So, okay. if, if, yeah, if you apologise to them and then apologise no. to me, y- yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. 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 No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. I'm not doing yes, it. Yes, you are. I'm not going to do it. Yes, you are. I'm not going to do it, actually. <laughs> I think you should, actually. No, I don't think I should, actually. Oh, I think you should, actually. No, no, no. no fine. You, oh, you know, you'll fine. have to think of another uh, way yeah, of like, actually, the rest of this time. I don't want you to apologise. No, no, well, I'm going to apologise. I don't want you to. Oh, I'm very sorry, ladies and gentlemen, no. for shocking the life out of the first 45 minutes of this show. But I don't care. And I wanted you to apologise, and you did because you're oh, an I idiot. I retract it. I retract that. I don't want you to. I, I want you to. Ret- I want you to retract it. Yeah. Well, this this is this is it now. This is the end. Okay. Bye bye. Utter utter bell. Unmissable late night radio with the original king of unconventional conversation. Make contact with Ian Lee. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We'll get you talking. Paul! Ian! We've had someone phone in to complain about our conversation. <laughs> yeah, that seems fair enough. <laughs> Say hello to Angelos. Oh, <laughs> That's a dream come true. Yeah. Hello, Angelus. How are you, pal? Yeah, listen, mate. You, you ring up to talk about the price of hotel rooms? <laughs> no, no, not hotel rooms, no. What was it then? I don't stay in hotel rooms, Angelus. Well, you're in a hotel room in Nottingham, isn't it? No, I'm in an apartment. Get with the programme, pal. What? Come on. What Keep apartment? Up. An what apartment. What apartment is it? An Do apartment. You own it? No, no, I borrowed it for the night. What are you doing in there? <laughs> um, what, what <laughs> at the moment? Yeah. Yeah, at the moment I'm just gazing out the balcony view over the Nottingham skyline. What, are you on holiday? <laughs> it does feel like that. It really does feel like that. You go to Nottingham on your holiday and stay near the apartment? Angelos, sorry, it sounds like you've got, I don't know, a, a, a sausage or a, a, yeah. a something in your mouth. I've got a sausage, actually, yes. I've got a very long one. Listen, mate, Barry there. He's, no, he's not here. 
Yeah. Okay. Uh, right, Angelos, are you, are, you, are you looking for your mum? Is that why you're calling, Paul? Did you see if she's there? <laughs> I'm, call, I'm calling because I know she's there. Angelos, your, fo- your signal's breaking up. Your phone, what's going on? Your phone is breaking up. Yeah, well... I'll break you up in a minute. <laughs> hang on a minute. There's no need for violence. Hang on a yeah, hang well, on. No need for violence. You're having a little bit of banter about your mum and her part time job. Yeah, you've been trolling me. <laughs> I've not been trolling you, mate. You've been trolling me big time, mate. You've been trolling me for three days while I've been trying to get my uh, roulette system going. Right, you have been interrupting that and trolling me and putting me right off my stroke. What roulette system is that? I've been working on my roulette system. Oh, yeah. How does it, how's it going? Probably up to about 23. Yeah. Mm. Oh, you think I'm going to tell you my roulette system? Well, g- just explain the base. Don't give us the specifics, obviously. That would be crazy. But just give us the basics of how it works. Well, you go in the um, roulette um, room, right, and you sit there. You do what? And you, get, you sit there and you get all your um, discs, okay? And then you sit there and then you watch the... Um, the circle go around, right? And um, the roulette the wheel on it. The roulette wheel. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, with the numbers on, and then there's the ball on it. Yeah, right. And then the ball goes on them numbers. Okay. Yeah, I know and how then, roulette works. I just wondered what your system yeah. was for getting money right. out of it. I'm going to tell you. Right. right. You listening, then, Katia? You, yeah. Yeah. Okay, listen, Katia. Right, and then you, the ball goes on them numbers, right? And then you wait until. A ball has gone on every number on the wheel, and that could take a few days, so you need to take some sandwiches, okay? Right? And then, when when there is one more number uh, the ball hasn't been on, you just keep sticking your money on that number, and eventually it will come up, and you'll, you'll probably clean the house out. What? Uh, is he, is he, are you still there? I'm still there. Are you still there, Angelos? Yeah, I'm still there. Okay. And while I've been working that system out, you've been trolling me. Yeah, well... <laughs> uh, here's the thing. Here's the thing, right? And I don't understand this, Angelos, but this is this is the thing. When a ball... When the ball... Right? Yeah. What, on the roulette? We're back on the roulette, um, roulette system. When it lands in... Say it lands in number seven, right? Uh, yes. The next time you spin it, the chances yes. of it landing on number seven are very slim. Are, yeah. No, are exactly the same. No, they won't. But as if it's going to land on seven again, it's exactly the same right. as before as the odds before it landed on that number seven. No, it goes on another number. Well, there's loads of, there's loads of numbers on that wheel. It's yeah. not going to go on it again. But not for ages. No, it doesn't take it doesn't take it in turns. So it, no, goes, it does. You go for all the numbers, and then and then you're left with one number that it ain't been on for ages, and then you stick all your money on that, okay. and then eventually yeah. you you'll have it off. Huh? Okay. Yeah. Have you ever been to a casino, Angelos? Yeah. Okay. I've and you, been there. And you've you've you've, you've played what? roulette, yeah? No, I don't play it. I, I'm working on my system. It's not a mug. How are rehearsals for the show going, Angelos? I've heard it's it's pretty hard work for the audience. Yeah, it's dismal. It's like um, it's like wading through treacle, really, at the moment. And yet it's billed as a comedy show, isn't it? It's a comedy show, yeah, yep. but we've, like... No a fun heavy bent on information as well. There'd be a lot of information there, right? Because if we don't, if we don't have um, like comedy to do, we'll just read out books and stuff. Yeah, and I I spoke to Barry, and he basically said he's he, he's worried the whole thing's going to be a disaster, and he, he was begging yeah. me, begging me to come and do some, open up some of the shows for you, be the opening act. Yeah, I know he said that. <laughs> 
I, and I am. But he didn't, hey, but he didn't know you'd been trolling me. I'm not. It's not. Well, with with fairness, in fairness, you sent me a picture on on Twitter yesterday of a scrap of paper. And if anyone wants to see it, they go to my Twitter page. It's my um, background picture that says Ian Lee is a twat. Yeah. Right. That's right. Well, I no, mate. I just found that in the road. Oh, you just found it in the road, did you? I found it in the road, yeah. Right. I found it in the road. And, and anybody, yeah, could have written, anybody could have written that. Katia, Katia yes, please do. Uh, what's the difference between a, a twit and a twat? Well, the, 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 the difference is, 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 is quite rude. They're two different chocolate bars. Chocolate bars. Thank you. Yeah. Sir Angelos, I will yeah. come and open up some of your shows for you. What, the door? But I want you to beg. I'm not begging you. I want you to beg for me to be no, the opening I act can't. for some no, of your shows. I'm not, I'm not doing it. I'll, I'm not I'll, doing it. Well, then I won't come and help you out, mate. I won't come and help those those uh, venues where the ticket sales have been sluggish and people will sit through your treacle show and um, will you you probably well, be suicides uh, after it. All right, well... You, I know for a fact on them nights when the ticket sales are very sluggish, you've got nothing else to do. Right. So, so you might as well, <laughs> you might as well come down there. Well, if you beg me, I will. I'm not begging you. You'll have nothing else to do, and you go, and you'll go. All right, I'll go. I'll go down there, and you know, and I'll do do your do your dance what? or whatever it is you want to do. So it is a dance, yeah. Street yeah. dance. Street dance. I oh, know, I want you to, to do some uh, magic as well. Yeah, do some street dance and some magic. That's the act. Yeah, OK. Well, yeah. that's good. Well, that's if, you good beg, if you beg me, if you say... If you I'm say, not begging you. Well, then I'm not doing it. I'll sit at home and watch it. Well, then I'm not begging you. Well, then I'm in not that, doing in it. That case, in that case, I'm not, I'm not going to beg you for it. In that case, this conversation is over, and I wish your tour the very best of luck, because you're going to need it. Thanks for calling. Before you go, um, who's your favourite actor? Who's my favourite actor? Yeah. My- Michael Keaton. I thought he was brilliant in Multiplicity. Oh, OK. Why, why are you asking? I don't know. What? Who's your favourite actor? She's James, I thought. Who? She James. Who? She James. Sid Ann's. She, she James. Sid Owen. She changed. Sid Owen. You know, she changed with a. <laughs> she, she changed. Well, thanks for calling, Angelos. Okay, bye. I'm glad he's gone. There's always. Uh... Apologies for the bad language there. It just gets very tense. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. Angelos, how do you listen to the show? Hi. How do you listen to the, the show and to Talk Radio? I've never listened to this show. Do I you... watch the telly. Right. Do you listen to any of the Talk Radio shows? No. No? No. No, no. no. But yet you, no. you, you, you constantly call in. Yeah. yeah. That's because I'm, watch, I'm watching the telly. Uh-huh. What are you watching on the telly? Oh, I phoned up to talk about the telly. F- sorry? I phoned up to talk about the telly. Okay, your, phone, your phone's breaking up, so... Um, we- oh, God's sake. I, I, live in, I live down the well. Um, I phoned up to talk about the telly. Okay. Oh, well, oh, let's. Okay. Where let's you talk go? about the telly. Let's. Let's please. Okay. Um. What um. What shows do you like? What shows do you like, Ian? Well, you've called up to talk about the telly, Angelo. So why yeah, don't you? I yeah, I know. So why don't you tell us what shows you like? I like Storage Wars, and I like uh, Eggheads, and I like um, Pointless. So like inter- intellectual, The Apprentice. I like that intellectual, as well. intellectual stuff. Yes, you know I, I won. Like I won pointless recently. Me and Keith Chegwin. Hmm. Okay, I'm on pointless. 
But being in the I, audience doesn't count as being on no, pointless. No, no, I was on it. I done it. When did you do I that? Done it. Um, about uh, about two months ago, I done it. And has it been on TV yet? No, not yet. No. And did, how far did you get? I got right to the end. And who were you on there with? Debbie McGee. Because I heard you talking about that um, thing on Channel Four. That National Treasure thing. Oh, yeah. 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 I heard you talking about that. Yes. And I thought I'd ring in and talk about the telly. Yeah. Because I watch quite a lot of telly. Oh. Well, we've, um, we've got someone... Because you talked about um, National Treasure, I thought I'd ring in and um, okay. talk about the telly well, as well. You, why don't you say hello to Philip from South Norwood? Hello, Philip. Good evening. How are you? How are you? Very well indeed. Oh. Um, I oh. get you phoned in about television. I'm really interested. Uh, just before we c- continue our conversation, Ian, you mentioned Judy Waters. Well, I, I don't know if you ever saw it. There was a film she made called She'll Be Wearing the Pink Pajamas. Have you ever seen Judy Waters in that, Ian? Or the person I'm talking to. I don't know your name. I do apologise. My name? Yes. Angelos. Angelus. Yes, yes. Angelus. Have you ever seen the film with Julie Waters in? Ian was talking about Julie Waters. A film Julie called... Waters, yes. Have you seen that film? She'll Julie be wearing Waters. pink pyjamas. Yes. It's about a group no, of I women. Don't... No, I don't. No, take on. It's about a group of women who go to an yes. outward, outward bound school. Very good film indeed. Now, the What's an outward phone... bound school? I beg your pardon? What's an outward bound school? She goes to an outward bound school, correct. And with her what is an group... outward bound school? An outward bound that? school, that is the school where they do uh, things, they go out into the woods and... Um, oh, OK. Yeah, it okay. is. It's a, it's, a, it's a really good film. Now, the reason and I... what happens? The reason I rang it, Angus, was that oh. Ian was talking about box sets. Yes. Now, I, I'm halfway through a box set from a TV yes. series from 1976 that... I know the one. What was it called? The Minder. No. It was an Australian series that oh. was shown... The Sullivans. No. Oh, it's a great series. Oh. No, this series... Great series. Only... Great this, series. This series was only shown in the oh. north of England. It was shown oh. on Granada. So the people, all the listeners in, in the show. Granada area will know this okay. series. Hmm. It was called okay. Bluey. I... Yes, of course. Did you, did you ever see Bluey when it was shown in the north of England? No. No. Well, Bluey, well, I heard all about it, though, off the internet. Yeah, it's a very, very yeah. good series. It's a, a story about a police officer in Melbourne. Yeah, and he's, um, he's, he goes after people what watch Blueys, isn't it? He, yeah, that is his name. No, he, he oh. doesn't go after people that are blue, no. What he does, yeah, that's his name. <laughs> no, I just thought he went after people watch what watch blue films, you know. No, 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 no. That was some other series that we've. Oh, I haven't heard of that one. No, but this is oh. a series that it's just been released on a box set. In those yes. days, there was a lot of controversy. How many? How many did they make of Bluey? Thirty-nine. How many? Thirty-nine episodes. God, it must have gone on for ages. No, well, no, it was only on for one series because this was Australia, Excellent. and they tended. Oh, they've got nothing else. Well, in, in, in America, I mean, on occasion, some of the series went to 26 episodes. And what they yes. would do, they... Well, 24 the thing, goes to 26 episodes. Or, or 24, 26, 25. And then when they've shown oh. them, they would repeat them in the summer period as reruns. Right. Like Hill Street that, Blues. Hill Street Blues, of course, yes, with Dennis Friend. That was a very, very good and That's show. also got Blue in the title, which is like Bluey from Australia. Yeah, oh, well, yeah, that's true. I mean, there was another thing, thing about Hill Street Blues is that it wasn't just shown in the North England. No. It was shown all over the no, England. it wasn't England, shown wasn't in the London area. Blue, Bluey was never shown in the London area. No, but was, Hill Street Blues was, and Hill that's Street the Blues point was. that I'm making, Patrick. Hill, mm. Hill Street Blues was shown all over the country because that was on ITV Network. Yes, exactly. So that was on a national network yeah. television. Do you know what Storage Wars? Story, I tell you what, the one I like is uh, Baggage yes. Battles. Yes, I love Baggage Battles. Is that um, to do with, like, baggage and where they battle That's right. Funny enough, about a couple of months ago, I met 
one of the people that takes part in that program. You know the what English were they like? Couple, you know the English couple that live in America. Yes, well, I do. I met the guy. And we had a long chat, and we were talking about the things he'd found, and a really interesting couple to talk yeah, to. Yeah. What, is, what is the weirdest thing he'd found in there? I, I think he said it was... A, it, well, it wasn't weird what he found. It was just the, the most interesting, and probably... Yes. It was a, it was a, a parchment, a, a big... that had a historical significance. Uh, and, I thought you uh, were going to say sex toy. He was a, he was a, it was a historical parchment that he found. No, okay. And, um, you know, and that was it. So, no, uh, anyway, yeah, what did he do he with it? To what we're talking to. Can I, uh, well, I don't know if Ian's got my email, but the film that he likes is going to be shown on Friday week, Saturday morning, Multiplicity, with Michael oh, Keaton. Yeah, Mar- so, I know you're listening, Mar- Ian, so uh, I know you're watching. You like that film. Yeah. Are you what do you like that? watching, then? What do you like watching, then? Oh, me? What, you, what, you, yeah. Well, I, as I say, I tend to be pretty selective these days, you know. Right. If I see something, I think, oh, I'd like to watch that, you know, and... Um, yeah. But, I mean... More like the news, oh, or news Egghead. Good, yes. Uh, I mean, mm. there's there's such a wide range of, you know, you've got the American news, the English news, if you've got satellite Catch cable phrase. or... You've got catchphrase. Ke- no, I've never been one for catchphrase. I don't know why, just... Uh, it doesn't... Um, well, he's never, never grabbed you. Never grabbed case, you. What about yeah, Wogan? In, Wogan in its heyday was right up there, wasn't it? He was indeed. He was a genius for broadcasting. He was a genius. He was a genius. of late night radio is back Ian Lee on talk radio we have ways of making you talk let's go who's your favourite caller to the show oh my favourite caller um I like Tris yeah um I thought Harry from some some obviously some I think a lot of us do but Jonathan yeah because of his complexness. Because of his racism. How about he, Barry? No, Barry no, from, no, no, not for that. Barry at all. from Watford. Um, I don't. I've I've known Barry from Watford from your early um from your older. Right. TV Are you not a fan of his? Um. Bit bit boring. No. Bit, bit past it. Oh no, him what are you saying? and Derek and Clark. Oh, is that Barry? Oh yeah, whatever. What are you saying? I'm saying, what was I saying? Oh, what was your last conversation with Cl- Clive Bull? Was it a nice one? Now, can I just say, okay. he was defending me. It's a sort of long pencil neck there you're talking to, isn't it? He was trying to have a prop. I know you were, Ian. I Hello. know. But he, he went away for a while, and then you went away for a while, and you both came back. Yeah. Did I'm you actually to Clive Bull? I don't know nothing about Clive Ball. But you did, you spoke to him. <laughs> well, very occasionally. She's thinking of the hilarious <laughs> oh, yeah, well, Larry from Catford. Yeah, uh, he was hilarious, wasn't he? Lynn from Forest Gate, yes. Barry from, to me was Barry from Watford, oh. and, and you sound to me like Barry from Watford. And well, you I do have... sound like Barry from Watford. Yeah, Who the hell are you, man? I'm crazy, uh, I'm, I'm crazy Beatrice from Wimbledon. No, I know who you are. Right, Andrea, I'm going to say goodbye to you. Yes, and it's been like a joy speaking to you as always, Ian. Well done for getting through today. Ta-ta. Um, no, uh, no, no. Are you going? No, I'm saying goodbye to that lady. Okay, you can you can go if you want. No, I want to stay. Okay. Um, I've, hello? 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 Yeah. Hello, yeah. Hello, is it? Angelos. Yes, hello, Barry. How are you? Oh, not not so bad. Yeah, I know you're okay, actually, because I'm sat next to you. <laughs> we're, we're phoning from the car. Oh, pr- you're, pr- you're pranking me. You, no, we're not pranking uh, you. You prank pr- yourself, mate. I'll prank we're, you in a minute in your nose. 
Well, Frank, right, well, you mate. come and try pranking me. Oh. Right, you didn't want to come down to London to prank me, so did you? I'll prank you so hard. You, and I, you, listen, you, I saw you the... You bottled out of that one. I didn't bottle out of it. I saw the video that you sent, um, for my show. Oh, yeah. up yours, flicking the Vs. You, you, you got a combined age of 263. Grow up. Yeah, yeah, very much the level of our shows. And this is what I wanted to talk to you about. Yeah. What do you want to know? What? What do you want to know? Well, I want to know, on behalf of my listeners, how people apply for refunds. (laughs) Well... Errors. Well, we, we, a lot oh, of makes me sick. That is that is yeah. disgusting. Who you ask the refund then? Um, I want name. I want name. I want a list. Okay. You, have you got a, a pen and paper? Names. Yeah, What's I have. Got, okay. I have, yeah. We've no, got write this, write this on your hand. You might need more than one hand. Mm-hmm. Steve. Are they long names? Steve. Steve. Oh, Colin. Steve. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Colin. Yeah. Tracy, plus one. Tracy, yeah. I will see you later, Tracy. Yeah, she's yeah. in the front row. Wahid. Yeah. Wahid, yeah. 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 No, okay. yeah right. Mustafa. Yes, yes, yes. Dave. Yes, yes. All big fans of the show, these guys, actually. Yeah, they, I don't they, know well, why they they've just been complaining. They've all been in touch. Yeah. Um, saying, oh, we bought tickets to go and see Barry and, um, what's, what's your friend's name, Barry, sir? Ed, Ed, You know what my name is. I oh, like, wanted you to come as well, but you never bothered turning up, huh? We've done all the jokes. We've done our pranking off joke. You what? Yeah, we did our song. Yeah, done our song. And that's done the problem. It. That's the problem. They, oh. They've bought tickets oh, right. to your tour. Yeah. Yes. Um, yes. Because yes. they've heard you on this Buy show. LiveNation.co.uk. Yeah. Uh, they've heard you on this show, so they thought the show would be funny. Humorous, yeah. 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 And, well, and it's it, not like belly laugh. It's no. Like, because we're discussing things in the zeitgeist. It's... And I don't know if you've had your head in the sand in the last couple of weeks, mate. Yes. But there's stuff going down in the world at the moment huh? which ain't yeah. very pretty, you know? We can't help that because we are just reflecting what is going on in the zeitgeist, you know? Right. Yeah. Um, it's more the kind of... Is, 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 is it true that your show's written by the same people that used to write Last of the Summer Wine? Well, some yeah, of it is. Yeah, we are, but, like, you know, you, those guys are cheap. Yeah. I mean, when we say it's written by them, Angelo's got an annual, uh, Summer Wine annual in 1978. We've just lifted some yeah, of the cash. It's loads of the jokes out of that. Yeah. And a bit where you pull your trousers down, Barry, that's yeah, lifted yeah. straight off of page three. Yeah. No. Oh, my trousers have fallen down. That has them rolling. And he's he no. fallen off the stage. Uh, can, I, can, I, can I read you an email from um, oh, Mustafa? God, this is typical yeah, of all the, go on, go on, yeah. the comments we've yeah. had. Um, dear Ian Lee. Uh, yeah. After hearing Barry and Angelos be faintly yeah. amusing on your show, I bought yeah, tickets to it. go and see them. Yeah. Yeah. I, I was expecting a right laugh. Right, yeah. Instead, what I got uh, was a lazy... Yes. Badly performed, right. poorly right. written, and he's unwritten in inverted commas to mean it's not written. Uh, listen, mate, this yep. is one man's opinion. Yes. Well, yeah, I've got just... I've got about two hundred emails like what this. Well, Tracy? Uh, like, Tracy would have liked it. Yeah, she was laughing. She laughed her, her head off. Her head off. Yeah, head off. Um, what is the procedure for refunds? Well, well you, you say, go back. just go to the box office and uh, yeah. just get the money back, I suppose. But I don't know on what you'd have to present like viable grounds. You'd yeah. have to go there with a like a ten point. Can I read you sheet who's saying exactly why? I've got a four. I've got a four word email. And then it will go before the judge. Yeah, I've got a four word email go from, on, then. from Steve go on, then. Uh, Steve Johnson. Steve Johnson. Yeah. yeah. Four yeah. words. Yeah. Describing your show. The subject title, subject heading was Barry and Angelos' show. Show, yeah. And the email, all it was four words, the show was shit. (laughs) Well, Steve is like, Steve is famously naive. He doesn't understand what we're talking about, sadly. The bloke has got a few issues going on upstairs. So, I mean, it's not our fault if he sits there just like you know, braying like a donkey, which is what he's done all the way through the show. We, we, what we, we come supposed on. to do with that? We, we come on, 
and the lights go up with big song and dance. I'm a bum bum, you're a bum bum, everybody. I'm a, a, a chicken man. I'm a chicken a bum bum. I like bits and bubs. I like bits and I like bubs. I like bubs. Everybody come and get the bits and bubs. Yeah, well, we haven't. Yeah, all that stuff. Everyone loves it. They did, yeah. they like we blew the, blew the roof off the place. Of course it did. And he sat there, Johnson, right, just yeah. making all these noises, like guttural noises, like... All right, all right. Like, yeah. like that. No, all right, listen, we, we're you running know. out of time. No, if, no, 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 we're, no. We run... have a right to reply, mate. Well, uh, you're, you're, come on. Can you come back? You've libelled us. You've libelled us. We have a we have a right to reply. Can you come on? Can you come back after the news? Yes. Yeah. All right. We will. As long as we get our right to reply. I'll shove the right to reply right up your jacksy. Yeah. Well, that'll be a start with a show. Why don't we do that? Okay. We'll do that in a minute. Across the UK, online and on DAB Talk Radio. For those about to talk, we salute you. Talk Radio. So after the news, um, Barry and Angelos, you yeah. still you still there? Yes, yes. Yeah, we're waiting, very, mate. We're very fine. Much, mate. Unbelievable. They'll, you want to give them a call? You know what to do. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. We have ways of making you talk. Get on with it. Is he there? Hello. Oh, this is what he does, though, isn't it? This is shit, he shits here, he's gone to the bog, isn't he? He's, he's got a treat, isn't he? He's having a proper air show, he can't even... Yeah, and he can't even speech. turn up for his. All right. Can't turn up for nothing, for this one. And he's, you know he's on about ten grand a week, isn't he? Oh, it? I've heard that, yeah. Yeah, he's on about ten grand a week doing this, and he yeah. shits there like Lord Muck. With his Money feet, his for old rope. Money right, just sits there with his cowboy boots yeah. on the desk, pressing buttons, reading the escort, you know? Yeah. And well, we know. all have to do the work for him. It no. makes, makes me sick. If you want to phone up, phone up, us, why not? We will listen to your calls. We can't take none of them because we haven't got any buttons. But I'm sure someone will um, provide their, their fingers to press them buttons. Yeah. Anyone there? Hello? Hello? <laughs> We've been cut off. <laughs> oh, is someone there? Hello? Hello? Hello there. Hello there. Uh, hello, Talk Radio. Excuse me. You're through to Angelos. You? You're through to Ty. Where have you been? Oh, hello. Hello. Who's that, man? <laughs> I was just sitting back enjoying the Barry and Angelos show, Ian. Yeah, well, that's what it should be, mate. Because um, we do a much better job than him. Well, what, is it? Hear, you want, what do you want he... to talk about? Well, I did. Hear... He ducked out, didn't he? Of fronting up for you, boys. He what? He ducked out of fronting up for you, didn't he? Yes, he did. Yes. So I what's... think oh, I'm very pleased you're here there. Hasn't gone unnoticed either. What's your name again? Ty. Ty? As, yeah. As in round the neck? As in round the neck, but spelt differently. Yeah, pronounced oh, the name. Okay. Thailand? Barry. As in Thailand, Thailand, as in Thai round the neck, in Thai yellow ribbon round the old oak tree. Okay. Yeah, and what all, can we do for you? The others. That name aside, what can we do for you? Well, I'm I'm the uh, apprentice correspondent, right? Of what? Uh, so I've so I phone up to uh, to correspond about the show, The Apprentice, the TV show. Oh, okay. I like that one with sugar. With sugar. What's going so, on in it? <laughs> so am I going to correspond with you then, Barry? Yeah, cool. I know, I know all about I, I know, it. I know what's going on as well, actually. I can't you watch on it. it. Did you watch yeah, it tonight, boys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah we saw yeah, all of it. it. It's the one did where you... they had to buy stuff and flog it, isn't it? <laughs> did you have a TV in your car? 
Yeah, is yeah. it the one where sugar fires someone at the end? <laughs> ah, well, hang on a minute, Barry, because it got yes, exciting sir. tonight. It got exciting tonight. Two people tonight. got fired, was it? Yeah, there was a double, double firing. Double firing. Yeah, yeah, Double yeah. bubble. I hope, double bubble, let's, hope one day, let's hope that one day sugar runs the country like, um, you know, Trump, Trump does in America. Like Trumpy. Now. Yeah, you'd have you'd have Trumpy. a sugar and sugar and Trump access. That would be funny, wouldn't, wouldn't it? Wouldn't that be something else? Oh, beautiful that would be. Wouldn't that be a thing? Oh my gosh! What do you want? What do you want? Okay, well look, I mean, Ian, I know what Ian. I love the way he just sits. This is like a throwback to his absolute days. So, yeah, should I just yeah. go into my review with you then? You're doing chain grand a week. You know that, don't you? Hello. Hello? Has he been cut off, mate? Angelos? Hello, Barry. You all right, mate? Yeah, I think that geezer's gone, thank yeah, God. He's gone, Ty. It's a shame because I was enjoying that um, conversation about sugar and uh, the apprentice program. You're through I to. Like you're, Angelos and Barry, you're through to Jonathan. Hello, Johnny. Hello, Jonathan. Lovely to talk to you. Where are you at the show tonight? I'm at home. Hello? Hello? Yeah, Hello. was you at the show tonight? We done a show in Bristol. Good show. Oh, in Bristol, have the Angel- yeah, and the Angelos and Barry show in Bristol. In Bristol, was was you in there? I I'm not in Bristol. Where are you? I'm at home. Oh, oh yeah, you're at home. Lovely, okay, lovely, okay. you're at home. Yeah, nice good, to be good, specific. Good. Yeah, very good. What are you doing there? Listening to you too. Yeah, right, right. right, aren't we? Yeah, we're good. We're running the show now, mate. Really? What can we well, do I, for I, you? I, 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 yeah. I wanted to talk to Ian. Oh, right. Oh, I, don't know, I don't know where he is. That. He's popped out for a minute. He's probably... Uh, he's probably uh, nipped well, off I, the... I, I, just, I just wanted to tell him that I, I've been through what he's been through and I've come out the other side and uh, just wanted to tell him... Uh, in short, to man up, grow some balls, and uh, he's got to start going to church and reading about stoicism because that will help yeah, no, him deal with his view. issues. That's a compassionate view to take, Jonathan. Yeah, well, so, uh, I think the thing is you've got to realise uh, yeah. if you if you've got these feelings of uh, guilt and remorse that there's yeah. nothing. Have you got them? Oh, I've had them. I, what I do did you regret. have them about? Still... Oh, lots of things. But uh, what one I've... thing? Uh, t- uh, too many, uh, too many to mention. But I will mention okay. this. There's okay. nothing you could. There's nothing you can do ever to make up for oh, the damage no. you've done. Nothing. Oh. That's why you've got to go to church and lay it all before. Well, uh, God the uh, Father, Jesus okay. the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Right. Which church you go to, mate? I I go to the local church. A lo- you local to your be- room. You, you need to lay it all. You before. mean in your living room? No, not in my living room. You need to lay it all before the ch- uh, uh, God, mm, Jesus, and the Holy I'll Spirit in church, and it. And if, by some fluke, you get the yeah. opportunity to make amends, yes. by all means take it, but you're not entitled to any forgiveness. And right. that's how you show oh. that, you, you, that you are contrite, by giving up your sense of entitlement to be forgiven. Yes, right. And you complement yes. that by, by becoming more stoic and reading up yes. on Sorry. stoicism, particularly yeah. Cicero, who went through oh, yeah. awful stuff in his life and... Mm. Can I, can I stop you just for one second, Jonathan? Jonathan. You say Ian should grow some, I think, b- 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 well, balls. Oh, balls, definitely the word he is. Balls. He is balls. Balls. He doesn't need them. He's got an enormous pair of there them. Is. He's got elephantitis. So. He has. When he, a real shame. Think, He's got uh, a medical condition. Yeah, we oh, come really? to see him he, in the studio. Oh, honestly, he I, was, I was under the, the impression that his wife had his balls in a jar. No, well, that's wrong. Right. That. No, that's wrong. No. He's, he's got a great big pair and he sits on them like a space hopper, which is why I don't use Periscope no more. 
That's right, because it was uh, embarrassing to see. And he do, he twirls himself round on the chair. Yeah. And if you're lucky, but you'll he, catch a glimpse. What, what, he, he need, what he needs to do is accept the fact that, that he's he'll never begins. be able to fully make amends and that he needs to go to church, lay it all before... We can't oh, get in the door with them balls. Read up on stoicism, read up on Cicero. He can't get his balls through the hey, door, honestly, man. It's very, very uncomfortable shitting on them wooden pews with great big balls, Jonathan. And this is, it is. You know, I mean, it's all very well, but forgive me. Don't drag them up the aisle, you know? No. Well, oh, it's very upsetting. A poor chap has got elephantitis yeah. of the... Bacolicus uh, Edipatitis. <laughs> and quite honestly, yeah. it's, it's a bit rich you coming on it. He's a master to his testicles, that fella. Yeah. Um, yes, no, wheelbarrow. So, yeah. um, the show is still going on. Oh, has it not been pulled oh. off the air yet? No, your, your, your show. Oh, if sorry. people, our show is yeah, yeah. We just we this is the sort of stuff that we get stuck into yeah. on, in the show. Yeah, and if people want to come yes. and, and buy tickets with a view to then immediately getting a refund, <laughs> where <laughs> live nation not <laughs> UK. And Ian, if you want to come and do your ball show as a sport <laughs> act, you're always welcome. You can come and do that. Well, you we know, you've see seen it. me do that thing where I um, clap them together like those executive oh, toys. Oh, yeah, they clap yeah, together. yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody because, dance. Yes, because one's together. bigger than the other. They make a lovely noise. Yes. Well, yeah. I'm going to cut you off first, Barry. Uh, right. Okay. Well, he's gone. And I'm going to cut oh, you off. Gone. I'm going to cut yeah. you off now, Angelos. Oh right, okay, that's fair enough. Um, and that's that. What a delightful mess, dear listener. Oh three four 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 nine nine one thousand. This is Talk Radio. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. Tweet a picture for the uh, what do they call them? Furry boys. The furry boys. Pivot. Yes, those guys. <laughs> ah. <laughs> A nice segue into our guest this evening. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, uh, would you please welcome to the stage, it's Angelos Epithemio. Good evening, Angelos. Good evening, Ian. Good evening, uh, Kath. Hello, How are you? <laughs> I think he's asking you? you first. Oh, me? Please? I'm fine, thanks, Angelos. How are you? Yes, I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm still fine. And how are you? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm not as well as I was a couple of seconds ago, <laughs> um, but I'm not bad. Yeah, thanks for asking. And over to you, Ian. How are you? I'm um, doing fine. I'm glad it's the freaking weekend, baby. How oh, are you, though, Angelos? Talk about it. I'm good. Um, oh. uh, um, actually, uh, funnily enough, I'm sat here dressed as Carmen Miranda. So you caught <laughs> Are me. Are you really? <laughs> yeah. That is a coincidence. I did not know that. I swear to you, uh, I did not know that. That's an amazing uh, coincidence. Yeah, I've got the fruit bowl on my head. I've got the Canadian fruit bowl downstairs. I'm looking <laughs> good. I'm looking <laughs> good. And a banana up your jacksie. Angelos, how are you yeah. finding the whole lockdown? Because that's your two main sources of income, burger vans and live yeah. comedy appearances. Yeah. Gone. Gone out the window. Well, I furloughed myself. So um, I put myself on uh, 80% of what I was earning. Um, so it's a, it's a huge drop because I wasn't earning... I wasn't earning anything. Right. So I've gone into the red. Um, but it's, it's all right. I mean, when I wasn't doing burgers and I wasn't doing comedy, I spent a good deal of my time sat at home. So things haven't changed wildly. Um, but the only difference, I suppose, after being in lockdown for so long, is that the place stinks. Right. That's the only problem. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yes, I do. Yeah, um, <clears throat> Yeah, so of what? Stinks. Of, hmm? Okay, of what? Of what? Sort of muck, you know, just general muck. Yeah. <clears throat> what does your place stink of? Mine smells of like sort of vanilla essence because I've got those. You know, um, you know, you don't get air fresheners anymore. You get the sticks in a bottle. I've got some yeah, of those it's, vanilla it's musk. The air fresheners. I've got the air fresheners. They really right. stink. You know, they yeah. smell like chemicals. You know. Yeah. Like ICI. It smells a bit like ICI in here. Do you, know? you Angelos, do you remember? Yes. The um, tape, 
No, do you remember the Take That documentary that basically kick-started the Take That reunion? Mm. And do you remember that? No, I don't think I do. Okay. Oh, yes, I well, the, do. Yes, I do. Yeah. And there was a big part, the four of them met up, take that, met up in a hotel room for the first time in years, right? Yes, and, I remember, but they was waiting for Robbie. Exactly. And do you know what? Exactly. The producer came in and said, we've spoken to Robbie. Right. He's not coming, he's not turning up tonight. Oh, and that, when, when did he say that to them? When well, he said that there. when they're all sitting there. The point I'm trying to make is, oh, right. oh, okay. Angelos, Where's this going? I'm, t I'm telling you, okay. the point is, Angelos, yeah. I've spoken to Barry from oh, Watford no. oh, and, no. he's, and he's not going to turn up tonight. What? Oh, dear. Okay. Well, I spoke to him last night, so that's no biggie. You know? No, but it would have been nice for the audience. It wasn't necessarily, you know, I'm sure you can phone him any time you want. I just meant for oh. the audience, but he's let the audience... Out. Basically, he's, he's urinated on your fans. What's his excuse uh, what this are, time? What is his excuse for not coming on? Um, what did he, he say? Uh, he, said he, he, he said he wanted to um, uh, watch The Wire with Margaret. What? Ooh, very unusual. He won't understand a word of that. Well, that's... <laughs> he, he, honestly... He won't know what is going on. That is, he might as well be watching Chinese. Let me tell you that. Yep. Good yep. show, though. Good show. I didn't like The Wire. Oh, okay. Well, it's rubbish, isn't it? I like 24. Uh, yeah, I like 24. I like the one where he was a heroin addict for the first three episodes and then he cured himself of being a heroin addict. Oh. What was that, then? That was season three, I think. I don't know. I've never seen it. Oh, okay. Sorry, I must have misunderstood. Um, are you doing some, because yeah. uh, I know that Barry has done mm -hmm. some live, sorry? Are you doing some? What? Live stuff. I might be. Are you, are you, were you going to ask me that? Yeah. Oh, okay, go on then. Why? <laughs> well, I don't need to ask it to you now, do I? No, I just want to make sure you are actually going to say them words. Oh, I'll just go on. Well, hang on. What, what, what would be the problem with me saying those words? No, I just wanted to make sure and, you know, just sort of preempt it if that's what you was going to say. Then I wanted to make sure I, I was all over it, you know. Okay. So, go on, ask a question. Go on. I've got a question. Are you going to do any live stuff? Yes, Angela? I am doing, I'm doing some Jesus. live stuff with Barry. Oh. Uh, my, yeah, we're doing a show called A Weekly Briefing. Every week we do it. And we basically answer, which is a half an hour show, cost about a fiver on the Zoom. Um, and you can come on and ask questions if you want. Um, and we will answer them, um, whether or not we have the answers or not. You know, we'll still oh. answer them. <clears throat> so let me get this right. Um, mm -hmm. It's 30 minutes. It's only 30 minutes. Only 30 minutes for a fiver. It's That's a, not bad. It's a whopping five pounds. It and you, you most likely won't have the answers to the questions you're being asked. There's a very good chance we won't have the answers, wow. but there's a very small percentage that we will have the answers. <laughs> so that's the basis on which we're working. You know? I like wow. those odds. <laughs> What's that? I like those <laughs> odds. I'm willing to take yeah, a gamble. Good odds, good odds. Why don't you come on and ask a question? Well, you know, well, like we come on here, you can come on here, you know, you can ask a question, you know. But we'd have to pay you five pounds. Yeah, so we'd have to pay five tenor. pounds, that's absolutely I right. I can ask you all the questions I want to ask you now for free. Yeah, well, I'll, I'll, well what we do is I'll answer, I'll answer as many questions as I can answer now, but I, I would just, I will, I will refuse to answer one question. Okay. okay. Well, let's see. If we, let's see. If we can get some questions for the listeners. Hang on a second. Line two. You're through to Angelos. Hello. 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 Who's that? Do you remember Gil Gascoigne? Yeah, I do remember Gil Gascoigne. The gentle touch. Then it was Cat's Eyes. Then she wrote a couple of novels. Then she moved to L.A. Then she moved, uh, married Alfred Molina, who was much younger than her. Um, and then, unfortunately, she passed away last week. Oh, well, that the your I hope that answers your question, Alan. Thank you. Oh three four 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 nine nine one. Did she really marry um, Alfred Molina? Yes, yeah. yes, yeah. Eighteen years younger. Lucky Molina. man. 
Yeah, lucky man. gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, very sexy. Uh, let's go to line one. Line one, you're through to Angelos. You can ask him anything. Anything you like. Hello. 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 There. Can you hear me? Hello. Yes. Can Hello. you hear me? Hello there. Can you hear me? Is it a bad line? Hello there. No, it's a very good line. Hello there. Can you hear me? I can hear you, yes, sir. I, I can hear you, actually. That's very good. Thank you. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. I've, I've Was that your been, question? Uh, uh, your yes, question, I can think. you hear me? <laughs> can I hear you? I've, I've been, I can hear me. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? I, I can. Can I hear mm. you? I can hear everyone. Right. Um, What's the question, yeah. please? This will go on and on. <laughs> yeah, the question The question is, um, well, basically, it's not a question. I've been given this number to uh, speak to Ian Lee. Right. Okay. Right. What it is, I'm, I'm isolated on my boat somewhere up the River Avon in Worcestershire, and I wrote a track about the lockdown. And uh, a friend of Ian Lee's recommended me to, to phone you guys through to air it because okay. apparently it, it could be a major hit. What's the track about? Lockdown. What your experiences of lockdown or just general lockdown? Uh, it's a bit of both, I suppose. What, like, so it's, like, it's something everyone can relate to? Yes, absolutely. And has it been written on the guitar or on the piano or uh, other, say, like, castanets or something? I wrote the words and put a guitar to it. Have you recorded the song, or is it still um, in sort of? Is it live? No, I, I haven't. I haven't actually recorded it. I'm on my boat with my phone, with my guitar, um, I, and I, I haven't really got a lot of equipment apart from that. No, that uh, doesn't, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Um, listen, just one quick technical question before you perform the song live on radio. Um, uh, if you're recording it, if you're speaking into your phone, how are you going to play the guitar and hold the phone at the same time, please? Well, I'll put the guitar, I'll put the phone on loudspeaker and, and stand next to it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Well, I haven't got a lot of choice because of the lockdown, it's, it's different right. for a lot of people, isn't it? I'm sure you understand that. No, I do understand. Is there any way you could gaffer tape the phone to the end of the guitar? Um. I'll tell you what, um, when, when you don't have to do we, that. You don't on, have to do that. We're, we're, not, we're not on air. We're not on air, are we, at the moment? Yeah, we are, actually. Oh, OK. Right, do you, yeah. do you, want, me to give you, do you want me to give you a quick burst? Yeah, let's just see if it's um, going to uh, gonna fly, you know? Yeah, OK. I'll go for it. Right, here we go. Yeah. Yeah, it's right, I'm just putting the... Me, me is, he, is he putting the phone on the no, table? Yeah. yeah, no, it's cool. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Can you hear me, sir? Yeah, have you put the phone on the table? Yeah, I have, yeah. Is that no good? No, that should be OK. Are you standing above the phone with the guitar? No, I'm standing right next to it. I'm about six inches away. Six inches should be fine. OK, take it away. OK, here we go, sir. Here we go. Lockdown. Lockdown by Sinbad and the Pirate. Sinbad and the Pirate. <laughs> People went mad for toilet roll. Now half the nation's on the door. Sitting alone without my soul. But I still got my rock and roll. <laughs> Down, don't you know? Yes. Can't go out, gotta stay at home. We're in lockdown, don't you know? Can't go out, can't say hello. How's that? I, that's beautiful. Uh, one thing I would say, I didn't. I uh, you didn't say it was an electric guitar. Ah, uh, sorry, mate. You didn't ask. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, you know that's the sort of thing you should be saying up front. You know. <laughs> Yeah, okay, no, fair comment, fair comment. It's beautiful but, song, though. The acoustics on your boat are very nice. Thank you. 
Yeah, thank you for your call, call. I really appreciate that. Oh three four 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 nine nine one thousand. My favourite bit of that was when he sang, "We're in lockdown, don't you know?" And Angelos, you went, "Yes." <laughs> well, I do Have know. The been... whole country knows that. Whole don't country they? knows. Have you been? You know that. It, Catherine's been. You've done what? I've written a song. Oh, I'd love to. Oh. I was about to ask if you've done anything outside of your usual artistic sphere. Uh, yeah. what, what song have you done? I've written a. I'm, I've, well, I'm writing an album, but um, <laughs> I've let, I've got a single all ready to go. Um, yeah. And I was trying to think of like subjects in lockdown that people can all relate to. You know, like our previous caller you said. Yeah. Um, and I thought probably uh, British wrestlers of the seventies and eighties is probably the way to go. Um, so I've written a song all about that. Yeah? Yep. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's no guitar. It's just okay. uh, me and the old vocals. And I'll probably just do the first verse, if that's okay. Because yeah. um, that's all I've written. Acapulco. Acapulco. Here we go. Here we it's go. called Cyanide Said Cooper at the Gates of Hell. Oh, oh. my gosh. Evocative. <laughs> there wow. we go. Here we go, this is it. Really? Yep. Adrian Street, pranced about, winning titles in every bout. Jackie Palo, he's your man. Believe me, I'm his biggest fan. Big Daddy, yeah, king of the ring. Hang on, the bell just went ding, ding, ding. Here comes Haystacks on his way. And right behind him is Johnny Saint, Johnny Saint, Johnny Saint. Cyanide Sid and Johnny Saint, Rollerball Rocco, Skull Murphy, and here comes Kinder Nagasaki. <laughs> that's, uh, that's as far as I've got. Wow. <laughs> that is brilliant. I'm laughing because it's so good. It's yeah, so good. good. I know. Um, that's, and that's, that's track one on the album. That's Chip of the Iceberg, mate. That so is, is, it, is the whole album about wrestling? Uh... Yeah, I think it probably will be. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You know, um, th- uh, you know, Kendo Nagasaki is a drummer. Yes, I do know, and um, his uh, drum teacher um, Lloyd Ryan taught me how to play the drums. Really? Yeah, he did. Wow. I'd go around there and I'd have drum lessons with Lloyd Ryan, and he'd sit there on his stool and talk to me for half an hour about Kendo Nagasaki. <laughs> And I'm thinking, I'm wasting my time here. <laughs> I'm 17 quid this is costing me, and I'm having half an hour about Kenbo Nagasaki, and I want to learn me paradox. Yeah, you used to dye his hair ginger. It's very strange, you know? Let's take that a call. Let's go. Story. Yeah, no, I know it is. I know it is. Let's go to line two. Line two, you're on the wireless. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Through to Angelos. Hello. Hello. Hello, you got, Ian. You've got your radio oh, on. Yeah, I'm just turning it down now. I am absolutely loving it this evening with all these people, with their music. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah. Me and my uh, partner, we run, like, open mic nights and um, um, jamming nights in Tamworth in Staffordshire. And, oh, my God, I so want these guys, when things get back on, going yeah. again. Yeah, well, you know, I'm sure they'll, they'll, be, they'll, they'll say yes to that. Just get in touch with the appropriate You know what? Parents. They're absolutely bloody amazing, don't you think? I think they should yeah. deserve some sort of record contract or something. What no, do you reckon? I definitely agree. Second, certainly the second bloke that sang, he should definitely get some sort of record contract, I think, and probably tour the yeah, world when, the when all that's been brilliant. So how's it how going anyway find- in quarantine? Yeah, you know, it's okay, it's okay. I'm, I'm missing sex. How are you getting on? Well, sex is always something that you're going to bloody miss, isn't it, really? It's going to be, yeah, yeah, I miss yeah, it, I miss it. Well, if you've got the internet, it's not so bad, is it, really? Well, you say that, but, you know, it's only a single sausage and I want something more, you know what I mean? <laughs> well, if you've got a single sausage, then that's a sausage to play with, isn't it, really? Well, that's all right, I suppose so, I suppose so. Thanks for having out. no sausage, or a sausage that's lost its skin, isn't it, really? Oh. I don't know. If I'm honest, I don't know. 
I don't know. How are you finding it? Well, it's all a bit of fun, really. Um, you know, I love it. I, I just think life's so bloody fantastic being here all, all by myself. <laughs> oh, you know what? Own, you? You know what? If you're all on your own, though, don't you think oh, that you, you can, can actually partner. get the oh, phone on you're... on the internet without worrying about somebody else jumping in and oh, finding you, oh. enjoying yourself oh, you for a moment oh. there? I thought you was with your partner who ran the open mic night in Chamworth. Shut up. It's gone to bed. It's all right. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, right. Yeah, well, that's all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 If I can't mention names of things on on the radio, isn't that good? Oh, you go away. It's got absolutely bloody fantastic, bloody shit on there lately. I will, uh, what poo, sorry, poo. sorry, I didn't mean to swear. Please what forgive me. Thing? That's okay, it doesn't matter. What's your favourite thing on Netflix? Well, I have actually been watching, um, what's it called, Steve? The Good Place and the Windsor. The Good Place Steve is right next to you. It's like gone to bed. It's like kind of mixing everything together, isn't it, really? I don't understand what's going on here. You said Steve was asleep. <laughs> Is on your own talking about like, having it off with people and he's stuck on your shoulder. Mm. Yeah, he was asleep on my shoulder. <laughs> no, goodbye, sorry, goodbye, anyway. Sharon. We don't we don't like liars on this show, I'm afraid. That was yeah, uh, no, we don't like that. Here. Little, little no longer walking. reliable. <laughs> Angelus, how so you're doing this on Zoom, these shows. Yes, we're doing them on Zoom. Have and, you uh, have you been um, porn spammed yet? I hope not. I don't know. What is that? It's when someone starts, someone hijacks the meeting um, and starts uh, broadcasting pornography. <laughs> no, oh. no. We had that. We had, that. We had, that. We did we one had and we had that. Honestly, it was it within, within a couple of minutes, all of a sudden we're looking at someone's very private parts. A sausage, yes. Mm. Really? You've had that mm. happen to you? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not bad for a fiver. <laughs> <laughs> when do you do? When do you, when do you do them? When's your next one? Because I, I want in. I'm 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 up I'm up for a fiver. Next week it's Wednesday night, but we can't decide what time it's going to oh. be. Well, what are the options? It, well, it could either be eight thirty, ten, or eleven, and well, we can't well, know which one to pick. Well, why don't you pick 8.30? Because then me and Catherine can join. If it's no. at 10 or 11, we can't join. Why? Oh, of course, because you're on the radio. Yeah, well, yeah. So I speak to my people. I speak to my people. Well, we were doing it on the Thursday night at 8.30. And, oh, um, okay. as, no, people come. But it crashed, a bit, it crashed a bit with the clapping, clapping for the NHS. So. Oh, yeah, how you can't it, do hang that. Hang on, how can it clap with... Cl the clapping's at 8 o'clock. Yeah, they clap for eight o'clock, then they're in for their dinner, then it's Netflix, you know, and we just we just getting squeezed out of the marketplace. But hang on, you're doing it on Wednesday. No, we was doing it on Thursday. But well, now we, you're doing it on Wednesday. The Wednesday to improve our standings. Okay. <laughs> I think it's a good idea. And how much money? How much of the ticket fee goes towards the NHS? Oh, a great deal of it, I'd have thought. I don't know. I'm not in charge of any of that. <laughs> um, but, you know, um, yeah, loads of, loads of it. Loads okay. of it goes there. Uh, how, do, how do people find out how, where and when this is happening and get a ticket? They go on, um, they go on the Twitter, at Epithemio, or at Barry from... And we will know um, many, many times over, over the next week, what time it's on where it's at, where you can get tickets, etc., cetera, et cetera, and what you can expect yeah. to see. And if you want to ask a question, you can, and there's a facility for that to happen. So there's all sorts, you know. All sorts Sounds very interactive, very interactive. Oh, yeah, yeah, very interactive. And whilst you're actually watching the show, you can leave messages for us. Oh. So it's, you know, it's, it's, a few, it's a future of broadcast. This, this show is shit. How do I get a refund? Stuff like that. Yeah, all that sort of stuff. All that sort of stuff. There's hundreds of messages like that. But the fact is, you can't get one. So we're, <laughs> we're in clover. 
And yeah. nice, I love I love you so much. I think that uh, I do not know why you um, hitch your wagon to that silly old sex maniac. Um, I think I think he's dragging other you down. He's pulling you off. Other way round, I think it is. You know what I mean? Um, I feel sorry for the geezer. No, oh. I love him. I love him to oh, bits. I love him. We, we love him. He's been um, keeping the spirits up here. Oh, he's a good man, isn't he? He's All right, Angelos. Well, it's lovely to talk to you, my friend. You're welcome anytime. Get a few. Um, I'll I'll have a look out for your next tweet about the show, and we'll give it a, a, a good old plug on yeah. on air. Give it a plug. Give it a plug. Let's it boost it them numbers, okay? Let's get it. Let's get it up. Let's get it up as hard as we get can. Get it up, mate. And get we'll it get in. Sp- oh. We'll get everyone smashing your likes. Oh, lovely. Thank you very much. Right. Stay, enjoy yourselves. S- stay safe, Bye Angelos. Now. Wash your hands. Yeah, I will. Yeah, and everything else. Okay. <laughs> Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye now. Bye. Put the phone down. Bye. You. Put the phone down. Say goodbye. Bye. Put the phone down. Bye. Bye. He's gone now. Bye. He's gone. No, nope, he's there. It. He's still there. Hello. Okay, the f- off I go. I'm away. Bye-bye. Put, bye-bye if you put now. the phone down, then we can yes, get Yes, I'm doing that now. Bye-bye. Play some music, please. Oh, he's gone. This is Talk Radio. Late night, Ian Lee on Talk Radio. 